Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. Hello, everyone. It's a me, Maxi. Hello. Hello, hello. Welcome to the pre show. In about four minutes or so, we'll be beginning the show proper. If you're watching the VOD, there should be chapters on this video. You can skip ahead to the beginning of the show. Hello there. It's me. Hi, Dale. Hi, Dallas. Hi, Ronnie. Worms for all the worm enjoyers out there, by the way. There really is no worm. This caterpillar, though. There you go. Oh, it's true. And today. Today is Friday. In California. Huh? Shoot! Shoot! <laughs> Today is Friday in California. Yes! Hello! It's been a little while, but we're back. We're continuing our Final Fantasy 1 randomizer run. Um, it's a good thing that I remember to save my settings. Because uh, I'm looking at the tracker and I'm like... Like, if, if you look at the tracker by itself, you know, the tracker that has, like, all the NPCs to talk to, all the items you need to get, and I'm like, what did we do last time? And then I check I check what, what I had saved, and we we still need to, we need, we need to, to find the tablet, translate the tablet, we need to bring the crown to Astalos, we need to bring the DNT to the dwarf. Uh, I, it's gonna be a little bit today. It's gonna be Lofailia for sure, and we haven't gotten the ruby for the for the uh, the giant, the troll, whatever that guy is, the ogre. Get out of me swamp! What are you doing in me swamp? Get me that ruby. We have the bridge, we have the canoe, we have the airship, and the regular ship. We have every means of transportation possible. Every means of transportation passable. Everything we need to do now is just to, quite uh, simply, uh, gather the rest of the uh, elemental orbs and uh, defeat. Uh, we don't have the oxyale. Okay, you're right. I mean, I don't consider that one a method of transportation. You know, it's, it's if you think about it, it's basically a key. It's basically a key. It, it, you know, it's a key that opens the door that takes us to the water realm. But you're not wrong. Uh, also. I have no recollection. <laughs> Hi, Kitty. Welcome. Welcome. Back. I love you. Uh, I have no recollection of where the water village is, or the village that has the dock. Uh, it would be really funny if that village is landlocked. I feel like that would be kind of hilarious. But other than that, today's Friday. Today means no work. Uh, last time I checked, uh, yeah, by the way, fun fact, uh, in Spanish, we pronounce Friday as, uh, no work. <laughs> Dallas says, everything is a key that opens a door if you think of it abstractly enough and or have played enough Baba is you. It's true. I spent all morning doing game dev, and I am both curious, excited, and demoralized. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm gonna be completely honest. <laughs> Dale is correct. Uh, Friday in Spanish is in fact Vietnam. Kitty says Friday translates to no mames. It's true, actually. No mames. All right, all right, all right. We're having too much fun, uh, which is good because I, I had a, again, I had a pretty. I spent all day working on game dev, uh, so I've left game. I've left the, the work being like. I have so much still ahead of me. And I, I'm, I'm, I'm saying this, Kitty, I'm saying this so you don't get mad at me, okay? I, okay I'm, I'm saying this so to beg. I'm pleading that you don't get mad at me. I am strongly considering changing the game engine. I am strongly considering changing the game engine. Kitty's gonna type in all caps, no. We will have a conversation today during our work meeting, aka our date, aka the time we go have pizza. Uh, Godot. I was thinking Godot. Uh, I was thinking Godot. I, I looked at game engines and I, I, I had a lot of con consideration. Um, Godot, there's a plugin for Godot that can, that 
uh, alleviates a lot of the uh, work of making of a visual novel, which is basically the game that I'm making is a visual novel, if you think about it, called Dialogic 2. And I watched a couple videos on it, I read some documentation, and I'm like, this might actually get us somewhere. Because th there is a, a few limitations with Twine that I am absolutely, <clears throat> incredibly unhappy with. But nonetheless, Dallas says, I will say my experience with Godot UI is troublesome. We'll see. I mean, it, again, it's it's just a little bit of research that I was doing today. We don't know where I'm going to end up. We'll see. I have to talk to Kitty. I have to basically convince Kitty that it's the way to go. But other than that, you know, I'm here. I'm chilling. Uh, and today we're going to play Final Fantasy. I'm going to stop thinking about game that for a little bit. Kitty's fuming. Oh, my God. Kitty's so mad. I can tell Kitty's pissed. Anyways... <laughs> Let's happy being a trans and autistic is super awesome. Day. Hello, Siska. Hi. Welcome back. Welcome. Why not use a VN making system then? Uh like the one we don't mention. I mean like I could I could use I could use Ramp I could. I could use Rampy. I could. I could. Uh am I am I gonna open the stream? By saying, by talking about why we don't talk about Rempy, is that what's happening today? Hello, everyone. It's me. The name is Max. <laughs> the name is Max. Pronouns are they them? Hello. Welcome back. Welcome. Welcome. Uh, welcome back to. Uh, please. Uh, you know, please don't stop the music. Actually, please do start the music. There we go. Let me bump it up just a little bit. Did Rempy? No, it's just um, it's 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 really just like development stuff. I have nothing against Rampy. I know you know. For instance, Chippy's making a game in Rampy. Chippy's making a visual novel. You know, uh, and I respect that. Yeah, <laughs> I, I I I don't know. I'm I'm just I'm just not sure. I'm just not sure about using Rampy. Uh Again, who's Ren and, wh and who do they pee on? Dude, you don't even want to know. You don't even want to know. Anyways, welcome back to Final Fantasy. Where's the music? This emulator keeps playing choppy music. That's why I'm not actually forcing you to listen to the choppy music. We're going to listen to the sultry tunes of Lo-Fi Leah's Lo-Fi remixes. Uh, check the description. Also, exclamation mark music. And welcome. We are we are in the fire. We are in, in, in the Gorga? Gorga Volcano? Gorga? Gorgu? Me, Gongaga. Welcome to the Gongaga Volcano, by the way. Oh, you can touch encounters by walking on the lava. That's fun. And by the way, yes, I do in fact have custom sprites. Hello there. If you're watching, if you're watching this part sec uh, first for some reason, <laughs> thank you, thank you. The good, 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 good volcano. Uh, I have custom sprites of my friends. There's me. I'm the thief. I've, I've. This this guy says I've certainly gone Gaiga in in this here mountain. There you go. All right, that's the first level of the of the volcano done. Uh, so welcome to the realm of nothing but a bunch of goddamn chests. It's probably faster this way. So let's see, a bunch of frozen frozen wolves. By the way, that this. Um. So, I do want to say, I did turn off a bunch of flash animations in the randomizer just for ease of use. <laughs> Kitty says, Kendra burst into the room. Did someone say Gaga? Okay. It looks like the only one not taking damage is Siska because they are wielding the... Um... Is that a Silk plus 4 helmet? I mean, like... Okay, alright. A, si a Silk plus 4 helmet. Who, who picked it up? Who picked it up? Can you equip it, Maxi? You can! Alright, perfect. Done. Done. Yeah, don't be a drag. Just be a queen. I found a tent. That's nice. That's nice. Man, this this part over here was absolutely made just to piss like players off, by the way. I respect it, though. I respect it. Yes, I'm still playing as myself, by the way, because I'm a little ninja. Muck? Uh, you know what? Let's have Nomia use their magic nunchucks as per the description. There you go. 
And Kitty's gonna use their their magic staff. This is, we're gonna defeat KOs with these fire nunchucks, by the way. That's it. And you may be wondering, Max, isn't that cheating? Uh, the game is randomized. Also, the rules are made up. Also, what are you doing in my house? Get out of my house. Why are you talking to me? Um, I want to see if we can kill all these frozen wolves with fire nunchucks. Also, by the way, this is my way to fight back against the randomizer because the randomizer gave me no healing spells. There are no healing spells anywhere. All, all the healing sp I forgot. I forgot to open the chest. The chest that is booby trapped with a bunch of wolves. Uh, so, the ga I randomized the magic, so who would get what, right? Ooh, you guys do a lot of damage. It's fine, we'll heal up in a moment. Um, and all of the healing spells, all the healing magic got randomized as uh, Black Mage magic. So, guess what? Guess what? Um, Nabbit's back. I will have you know, by the way, I have never in my life watched a single episode of Trophy. People, people's gonna be like, Maxi? That's disgusting, Maxi. How could you? I don't know, man. It, just, it wasn't. It wasn't near my orbit. Actually, I think Kitty might have showed me one of like the people from Drafty have to draw a thing. I believe. I believe that is what the name of their channel is supposed to be. I think you would rather enjoy it. I probably would. The thing is, is that now, unfortunately, I'm signing up for um for spending the next uh you know. 10,000 hours of my life just looking up Godot tutorials. Will you draw me like one of your French girls for a fee? Now, Maxi, you're navigating these uh, pathways here with a lot of familiarity, Max. Ha have you played this game so much that you memorize everything? No, I have the maps on the side. I'm not. I'm... Oh, Nomia is dead! Alright. So, Nomia is dead. Do we. We don't have life, do we? Nope. We don't have life. Alright, let's... Do. Unfortunately, Nomi is actually kind of like our big damage dealer. So thankfully, you know, I'm thinking we're gonna open all the chests in this floor and then, and then exit. No, oh, we also don't have warp either, by the way. Maybe Nomi needs more armor. Bla oh, we blast! That's the blast! No, 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 blast! No, 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 blast! Blast is an item. Yeah, Blast is an item. It's not on here. Wait. Siska has an axe that casts death? Or... No, no, no. Double X is death. Nuke is what I would like. I would like it to be Nuke. Unfortunately, it's not. I mean, like, cast it anyway. Fire plus one. That really is all you got, huh? Well, fire plus one is, is better than fire plus nothing. Siska's very- Siska's wielding the Moonlight Blade, it's true. By the way, can we talk about that incredible art, uh, Siska did the other day, by the way? Siska made beautiful art of- <laughs> this, of this ridiculous campaign the other day. It was so lovely. I wanna say once again, thank you for doing that. That was so cute. All my friends are so talented and cute. I call that my stop ax axing questions move. There you go. I already opened both of you. I'm so bad. I I have I have no memory. I have no memory. My brain is very small. I was so happy you put me in there. Oh really? Aww. Of course I would put you in there. Who else would I trust to be my, to be our you know to be our tank? For a hot second I thought you were down to have health, and I'm like, or you were at critical health, and I'm like, wow, Siska is at critical health at 314 HP. Now you got stunned. All right, that makes more sense. I bet we can kill you guys with one use of the of the staff. Uh, Siska is now poisoned. But see, the trick is, is Siska's act is actually already um, uh, Siska's a toxic bitch. So uh, in fact, I'm not even concerned. Can someone else equip nunchucks? Uh, no. I have a faint feeling only only monks can equip nunchucks. Kitty's also now poisoned. Don't worry, we have heal water at home. And by at home, I mean literally like in my pocket. You know, people got so people out there they got monsters in their pockets. Guess what? Guess what? Nabbit's back. That's right. I'm not even gonna finish that other joke. 
Um. <laughs> that is true. Siska says you're talking to the girl who fell on her knee three times one winter morning after cycling for an hour and just walked the rest of the way. <laughs> Hi, Chippy. Welcome back. Welcome. How you doing, Chippadees? Me shaking your hand. Hello, Chippadees. So, um, Kitty and I, we were like, we were, um, bo we were bonding? No, we were like, yeah, I guess we were bonding over like or random algorithms on like YouTube Shorts and TikTok. Um, you know, Kitty, Kitty's like, I don't watch any Glee-related content, but they keep giving it to me, and I'm like, it's because they know you will watch it, because Kitty keeps watching it. Kitty keeps falling for it. Uh, and I'm like, apparently, ooh, it casts lightning too, huh? A silk shirt minus one, I could not care less. Let me grab that silk shirt minus one and just drop it. Silk shirt minus one. Wait, can you equip it on top of everything? You probably can't. But you only have the copper shirt, so drop 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 that silk shirt. And also drop drop this. And the flame shield stays. Oh, because we have the protect ring. I'm pretty sure you're 23 defense. What are you? Yeah, no, the, the flame shield is just objectively better. Just give this to someone else. Give it to Noms. Noms can't equip it, huh? All right, well, then then just drop it. I'm good. I paid my taxes, but I'm uh, but I'm all set till next year now. Hell yeah, let's go. I mean, like, you gotta, you, you know, that's just stuff you gotta do, you know? Now, who... I need to trade... Oh, uh, a lightning plus not lightning. Oh, that is light. That is literally the same thing as Kitty's thing. Can anyone else wield this? Better than that. Let's have Siska literally like. Let's just have Siska also do lightning. Why not? A quake. Ooh, quake plus eight staff. A tempered sword. Don't care. Experience in a box. Cast sap. 10,000 gigabeezies. 4,000 experons. 6,000 experons. Chain minus two. Don't care. Uh, Alright, so how do, how do I... What's the fastest way out of here? There isn't one, huh? Alright, well. Time to just walk, baby. Haha. <laughs> I'm also doing the strats that uh, I remembered from Dallas that if you walk on the lava, you actually don't trigger an encounter. Alright, so we need to go. Unfortunately, unfortunately, uh, Nomia's dead. And last time I checked, we need those fire nunchucks. I love Siska taking one damage, by the way. Uh, now, wait, no, it's, uh, it's select and be at the same time? Yeah! <laughs> I remembered. Okay, where's the nearest town? I'm gonna go like up and to the left. Maxi, you went up and to the right. Shut up, shut up. No, this is Astro. No, this is the Elven ca castle. Okay. I would like. Take me to your nearest set. Okay, no, it's actually across the way. Thankfully, there's no air encounters, though, like, let's be entirely honest. You could have air encounters in Final Fantasy. Oh, oh, look, there's a village literally right here. All right. Oh, it's Provoca. All right, hello. I would like for you to please revive Nomia. Yes, please. Revive my friend Nomia. And now we're going to walk into the inn. Hello, old man. The herb? Do you try asking the blacksmith? I already have the herb. Thank you very much. All right. You know what? You, you, okay, so when I was on the road to Oregon, I had I had a, a dangerous thought. Are you ready? I thought, wouldn't it be wouldn't it be neat? Wouldn't you think my collection is complete? Uh, wouldn't it be cute? Hear me out. Wouldn't it be cute if I made a um, I made a tile <laughs> a tile set for Final Fantasy One that made it look like a like a um, like a roguelike, like an ASCII roguelike. Like your character icon is the at symbol. The color of the at symbol depends on your class. All of these would just be like ASCII icons. 
I bet oh, I'm the only person who's like, oh, that would be cool. That would be like kind of neat maxing. Unfortunately, I don't have time for any additional projects. So that's it for this level of the dungeon. Now this is this one's just a straight line. That's, this is just a straight line. Okay. Oh look, you can feel free to to put your mouse over my mouse on the screen so we can hold hands. So that's it for this level. Now this one here, we want to. Huh. Strangely enough, this map. Oh. You go to the fourth level first. I hate this place. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's bad. Dungeons suck. Okay, and now we're... Oh, now we're in part three. Oh, I hate... I hate this shit. All right, so it's down. It's down. And to the left. And then... And then down again. Holds your hand. <laughs> I got your cooties now. Excuse me? I think it's in my cookies, and I'm like, are you... Siska, you wouldn't be running a uh, spyware on my computer, would you? Would you promise me? You, you you would tell me if you were running spyware, would you? Okay, so can, can we talk about the mud golem, by the way? He's kind of like, he's kind of voguing right now. He's doing some vogue. He's doing some vogue, and I, honestly, I'm kind of like living for it. I like all of us just little, just swinging weapons. We're not even, we're not even like attacking with our real weapons. We're just swinging them for their magical abilities. Chippy says, what would you do if I made you a cookie, but I ate it? Chippy, you wouldn't do that, right? You wouldn't do that to me, right? That would be so cruel. It would be so cruel if you're like, I made you a cookie. And then I'm like, where is it? And you're like, I ate it. And I'm like, what? French, right click on Chippy, remove friend. Dude, just die already. Dude, just die. You know what? I'm actually going to cast a spell right now. I'm actually I'm going to I'm going to cast death on this guy once. How much HP do you What if we just hit you? What if we just hit you? That was that was, was that 423 damage coming in from Siska? Uh, dia, dia 3, don't care. A cabin? I'll take that, thank you very much. Now, if we... My voice cracked like I'm 14 again. That is literally chump change. Ron is the hacker amongst us. I didn't know Ron knew how to code. I was like, shook. How about I do just don't fight the mud golems? How about I just don't fight you guys? Uh, Thunder 1, don't care. 126 Gigi BCs. I am a web developer to be, yes. That's that's fun, I didn't know that. You learn something new about your friends every day, especially when you like talk, uh, when you ask them to tell you about themselves. All right, now I wanna walk around the trigger, by the way. There we go. Now, this should be one more box, and then we're going to the big room where uh, Karen is. The crown! Let's go! Bingo! Alright, the crown was here. Okay, now we can go talk to Astalos, but we won't do that right now. A bunch of... of... of what? That... that probably is the worst encounter in the entire game right there. Where he has many sights, like a D20. Oh my god, everyone's about to die. Please, run, just run, just run, just run. Please, please. We made it. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. That was absolutely horrible. That was legitimately terrible. All right, so, uh, welcome to the next part of the, of the game where we clearly Unfortunately, we will not be defeating Karen with these stats. Uh, we have to go back. These stooses are dead, and we don't have magic to res them. Wait. 
Wait, Maxi knows life? You can guess the tw exactly two times? Okay, uh, welcome back to I don't know how to read. I don't know when I learned life. Don't talk to me. Don't act, don't act like 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 you would have like you remembered. You didn't remember either. You could have you should have been yelling at me the entire time. Like, yeah, Dallas says sometimes mummies just call it call, just call lightning in, in the in the volcano. It's true. Maxi has a life, excuse me? Oh wow. I can't believe my wife made that joke. Taken down by a gamer. Uh alright. I am 19 and I never learned how to read. Do you understand life? Dude, I wish. Someone remind me to buy a bunch of potions next time that I go to the freaking town. Next time we go to Trader Joe's, remind me to buy some potions, okay? Alright, and now... I, I gamma? No, thank you. And lotions. I will say, though, Trader Joe's is a really, really nice... Uh... <laughs> Coconut butter moisturizer that I use every day. All right, there's ch so unfortunately I have to check every chest because there's a possibility that there's a key item like the crown. So I'm gonna I have to check every chest. So that means we gotta go north first. Those are candles. Those are not chests. They're candles. Okay, well that that makes things easier. The mochi ice cream at Trader Joe's is actually goaded. A Dia 3? Don't care. Legitimately don't care. Don't talk to me about Dia 3. There's a chest in this room right here. Another Dia th How many Dia 3 weapons are they storing in this here dungeon? You're the last room that has a thing. No, there's one more room that has a thing. Fire spirits? Don't care. Ah, yes, yes, invisible walls, I see. An another harm three weapon? Excuse me? Am I, am I, am I, am I drunk? Oh, they used to have an eggplant spread that went so well on a quesadilla. Dude, you're making me hungry right now. You're making me so hungry, Chippy. Also, somebody may be wondering, Maxi, you're not taking damage in the lava. Yeah, turn that off. Uh, why? Because the game is already crazy enough with random elements. We have to kill the mummies. We have to strike first. We have to strike first. We're, this is so bad. This is legitimately so bad. We we have to we have to strike the mummies first. This could be where we die, by the way. This could be where it all ends. It could all come down, come crushing down right here. So if they attack physically, they literally do nothing, huh? It's when they cast magic that everything goes bad. 60 damage? Okay, 110 damage. I love variants. I love variants so much. Okay, yeah, there you go. One thunder and we're literally like already on the ropes. Fire. You have to be weak to fire. Okay, okay. We we are stabilizing. We're stabilizing. We're stabilizing. We stabilized, okay. Alright, so, now, there is a past ability that as soon as I walk into that chest, there will be another encounter with the unskip, with the trap encounter. So, um, you may not realize this, but you're like, Maxi, you, re you run into that encounter again just on the way to a chest. I wonder if that means something. Yeah, it means that that encounter, that the tile is trapped. That's how they made it, so players would be forced to, damn it! Okay. It's, yeah, it's, it's the wizard mummies, that's what it is, yeah. I'm gonna run. I'm gonna, I'm just, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna run. I'm just gonna run. Do, uh, the, uh, okay, this is the worst, by the way, because you have the cockatrice and the peril, per, per, perilisk. They, they, they just turn you to stone. They turn you to stone, which basically kills your character. Okay, uh, Siska is underneath. Siska is about to die. Please, please just survive. Just, we just need one of you. Oh my god, we escaped. All right. 
Okay, we're out. It might be average speed luck for running too. I I do believe they fixed it so luck at uh speed does things now. So this guy doesn't know any spells. Don't worry about it. Uh, cure three. You have no spells. You what? You have no spells, lots. What are you? What are, what are you doing here? Nomia knows all the elemental spells. That is kind of hilarious, actually. I mean, like that 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 was pretty good healing. Unfortunately, oh, we do have soft actually. Oh well. That makes that a particular element less terrifying. I do think we have a past ability to uh, get through this with... E we might be able to kill the boss because she's literally down this away. Am I going to make a save state? Nah, we're going to we're gonna do all of this honestly, okay? Wizard Ogre, okay? If you have Wiz at the start of your name, I don't want to talk to you. I, 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 I don't need to know what you do in your off time, okay? Alright, so, um... Let's see. <laughs> Before they invented multi-tier potions, there was menuing. It's true. I actually, um... I added, um, the quality of life option that would make it so, um... Oh, I, I forgot to add the... The, the, the Earth Crystal. Um, there's a quality of life update that makes it so you have n new items in the game like Phoenix Downs, but none of them have dropped. So, hence here we are today. It is you, the tinder that defeated the fiend of the earth and disturbed my sleep. I, Karen, will now show you the force of fire and you shall burn it, burn in its flames. Alright, yeah, sure. What? Dude, her... <laughs> Her color scheme is all messed up because I randomized the color schemes. That's so funny. It looks like she's wearing like a 90s style like psychedelic pants. And she, she and she, yeah, she has like blonde hair and like tan skin. Hi, Barbie. Hi, Barbie. Right, I'm, I'm going to just hit you. And Nomi's going to do nunchucks. And I'm going to cast Cure on, on, on Siska. And Kitty is going to cast Lightning. It is kind of serving, yeah. Okay, th that, that looks like damage. Okay, so definitely magic is not doing anything. Thankfully, though, thankfully, we have the ability to cure to cure us. With a thing with thanks to these items, I'm gonna use temper. Can I cast temper on? I can cast temper on Siska. She does have that gyro look kind of going, yeah. So the AOE is kind of problematic. Thankfully, we have infinite healing in the form of, um... Doesn't... Fire doesn't work on the Fire Fiend? Okay, listen now. You think you're being really cute, huh? Please heal me. And then, please, you heal... Heal yourself. Heal... Heal yourself. Nami's not doing much in this fight. I'm gonna try Quake. I wanna see how much damage, uh, Siska does. Oh, oh, she cast haste on, her, on herself. That's great. That's great. That was 300 damage? Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Siska, Siska does it. Siska, Siska does it. Bingo! Shoutouts to Siska, by the way, once again. Doing the Lord's work. And with this, we have earned ourselves... Ah, uh, the, the one with the sparkle, the fire crystal. Let's actually go. First and foremost, before I do absolutely anything in this game, we're gonna go over here. We're gonna rest in a house. Heal our HP to max and save the game. Perfect. Now, where did I leave? Where did I leave Astos's house? This is the Elven place, right? I need the Ruined Castle. I think it's, I think it's up, I think it's up this way. It's, it's oh my God, there's Swampland. I think that it's, it's north though. There it is. There it is. Nope, this is the Chaos Shrine. All right, not this one. Sorry, I parked, like, one centimeter away. Guys, listen, I, I, I'm not buying anything. I'm not, I'm not looking for any service. Thank you very much. Oh, there's a Temple of Trials. We still have to do the Temple of Trials, actually. That's gonna be a pain in the ass. So that's the one that you normally do to get the rat's tail. We already have the rat's tail, so we don't have to worry about that part, at least. 
I don't feel like I remember... I don't remember it being on this first continent. Which tells me that it has to be on the continents to the side. That's a little town right there. That might be Cornaria now that I think about it. Another random town. That's where we left. That's where we parked our ship. Oh, so long ago. That's another town. This might be. Is this the cursed town? Did you visit both of those inland towns for the water shrine check? Um. Dallas, could you remind me what the water shrine check is? Because you're forgetting that I'm dumb. My brain is very small. Because isn't the way to enter the water shrine is by t by talking to the lady at the ducks in the water in the water village, right? I want is, is this Corneria Castle? Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba. Okay, yeah, yeah. Um, uh, the Oxel requiring fiend temple. Okay. I mean, like I. I mean, I assume we have to get it somewhere, so I haven't really bothered, like, checking the the town itself, if that's what you meant. There... Are you literally the point furthest north? Is that literally what it is up here? No, no, it's, it's just one of the holes that has the dragons on them. Okay. So it has to be in the big island that we were at just a moment ago. I'm gonna loop around the world. Fun fact, the world is not flat. Do not let the two-dimensional part of this world trick you. This is, in fact, a three-dimensional world. If you're enjoying the road trip action, it's a Taurus. Okay, listen now. Oh yeah, we have the the, the wind the wind tower. Okay, well at least we know where we're going in a little bit. Don't ask about the sun. Listen now. It's not you. I checked you a moment ago. This is the Elven town. Yeah, this is the Elven town. It's gonna have to be... It's in here somewhere. I'm gonna fight him. He's not gonna hide from me. There's like another chunk like higher up. I wish this landmass looked like anything I recognize. It could like make a joke of like, oh, that's, oh th this is it right here. This has got to be it. There we go. There we go. Let me really quickly actually just use a tent right here. Just to save the game. So, in case I die. Are we gonna have to get out the graph paper? I hope not. Sir, here is your crown. Ha ha ha, I am Astos, king of the Dark Elves. I have the pear? He has the pear! And now you shall give me the crown now. Dude! Alright, so. Which, so, he's gonna, he's gonna give us the ruby, which I changed to be a fruit. Why? Uh, well, t take a wild guess. There's a fruit on this stream. You're talking to it. Uh, yeah, cast fire on you, and then cast lightning on you. Yeah, yeah, so I, I like Siska walks in, swings swings her huge ass moonlight axe, and it's over. We obtained the pair! Bingo! All right, so I changed, I, uh, so Max, explain the joke, Maxi, please explain the joke. I don't get the joke, Maxi. Okay, so uh, in the original Final Fantasy, you have to give a ruby to this big old giant, right? And he eats the ruby. He goes, munch, munch, I love rubies, right? That's kind of like the joke. Um, you, In the randomizer settings, you can change it to be a different kind of food. Uh, so that it makes more sense, but also because it's just funny. Is this it right here? No, no, this is the... No, no, this is the, the sages area. If only I... Had remembered where. See, if only hasn't been, because it's been two weeks, right? If it had been a week, maybe I would remember where everything is. So it's a cave. We have to find the cave where my good friend. This is the sage area, which you get in vanilla by giving the ruby to the giant. That is so funny, though. That is true, actually. Yeah. That is so. Wait, maybe it's here. Eh? Huh? I can't park there. Oh my god. Is there nowhere to park in this whole island? What about here? I can't park there either? 
Wait, wait, what? This looks like it's a, like one square. No. All right, kids. How far away do I have to park the car? Yeah, I'm straight. Oh my god, I have to park the car so far away. Which town are you, by the way? You're the cursed ass town in the in the. Um... Uh, can Siska learn any magic, by the way? Siska can learn no magic. Perfect. Melrond? Yeah, it's Melrond. Yeah, yeah. Potions! Thank you, Ronnie! Now, to check if they sell potions here. Ironically enough, I'm pretty sure that Melrond does not have an item shop because that's kind of like the joke, is that they're broke. Thank you, though. Alright, next shop I walk into. Remind me. <laughs> remind me. Hey, old man, what do you have to say? The Earth Orb is shining again? Okay, yeah. Yeah, man. That was me. I did that. Okay. This is the ice cave. We have to do the ice cave anyway. Uh, let me grab the map. Let me grab the map. We have to do the ice cavern anyway. Might as well just do the ice cavern now. The ice cavern is how you get... Um, you would get the levy stone here, which means there must be another key item here. So let me open the maps real quick. All right. And into this place we go. Let me just save the game so we don't lose time. We have no potions, but it's fine. I intend to get into no encounters. We're also pretty high level, so. Oh, the, the Frost D. Anyone else? Anyone else having a, a Frost D? <laughs> Please don't hit me. That wasn't that bad. Okay. Okay. I gotta... Ch I, I gotta check the chests. Unfortunately, I have to check the chests. Oh! I can't even go this away. Okay, perfect. Redeem Hydrate? Thank you! I'm gonna take a second, actually. I'm gonna put down my controller. We're 30 minutes in. We already got a crystal. We're not doing too bad. Question. Yeah, we have the key, the floater, the pair, the rod, the crown, the cube. We could go up. We could go to like the... Oh, this area sucks. It's just a big old square. I mean, I guess we could try fighting the dragons as it gives us a chance to heal for free using our staff, but whatever. So, wow, I wonder which way I need to go. And now here. So you may be wondering, Maxi, what's the trick with this dungeon? The trick with this dungeon is that that there is holes. I'm gonna run away from the ghosties. No offense to all the ghosties in chat, but I'm gonna just kinda like there you go. So there are holes in this place. There's some holes in this town. There's some holes in this town. Um 96G. Wow. You don't say. My favorite child Shia the Buff movie? Kitty. Kitty now. It's it's just water. Dude, imagine you walk out into a lake and then an encounter pops up and it's like water attacks. Uh so what hole do I want? I think I want to drop. I didn't mean to drop in that hole, by the way. Oh, they ran away for a hot second. I thought they like, they did like bees and like they stung us and then they died from stinging us because we're so tough. All right, so I believe that there should be a bunch of treasure here. Uh, uh-huh. Mithril, don't care. So fun fact, uh, in, in the English, in the Spanish version of Final Fantasy IX, which I have played, uh, they rename Mithril to uh, Mitrillo. And I've always thought it was kind of cute. I always thought it was kind of cute. Mitrillo. Uh, that's, that's what I'm going to call Mithril. Oh, it's a sorcerer. Uh, that's what I'm going to call Mithril in my RPG. <laughs> I'm going to call it Mitrillo. People might pronounce it Mitrillo, but I'm okay with that. Nothing this away. Arbone! Mr. Arbone, nice to beat you. Uh, the R starts for Robert. 
Randy? Hello, it's me, Randy B Bone. Randy, B <laughs> Randy, do be doing what? Okay, all right, all right, all right. Ooh, the mother load. No, don't care. Money, don't care. Money, don't care. Copper, don't care. Uh, a fire elemental in the ice cavern. Yeah, checks out. I wonder. I hope not. Heal too? Okay. We have to give this hammer. We have to give this hammer to... To Kitty. So Kitty has a healing ability. There you go. Now Kitty has... Kitty now has an actual... If I don't, if if I ever learn how to menu, by the way, there you go. Kitty, Kitty has a healing hammer plus two, or a healing hammer two plus six. Actually, forgive me. Now this will take me back up here, which is the other side of that area. There should be a, an item here. It's a soft. I don't care. Who are you calling a softy, etc., cetera, etc.? Cetera. A bunch of experience. That's pretty good. I hit you with my hammer and heal you. Yeah, that's exactly how it works. Nomia, use your fire nunchucks on the dragon, please. And I am going to cast fire. And I want Kitty... You know what, Kitty? Use your hammer, Kitty. Hammer time, Kitty. Never mind, the dragon died. That's a lot of experience! Never mind, we're gonna be fighting dragons here for like half an hour. A ripoff. The, T the TNT was here the whole time! Okay. All right, all right. Bingo. We got the TNT. And instead of the eye, we're fighting the nightmare. All right, uh, here you go. Dragons give XP, it's the ultra, it's true. Dragons should give experience points. <laughs> oh my God, we're, we're, yeah, we're definitely over overpowered for this section. And then, oh. <laughs> What's inside the box that would contain uh, the cube or what? Oh, the levy stone. It's just a tent. All right. I realize we actually have to go around. We, yeah, we have to go. We have to redo this entire section again. Thankfully, it should not take too long. Oh, oh look, it's actually, there's no wizard mummies. I was about to be like, wizard mummies? Oh no. Wait, I got an epic dragon mommy? Oh, mm, I see, I see, I'm dumb. Uh, you may wonder, Maxi, what happened? Uh, there was a staircase I could have just taken. Maxi, you said you had the map on the side, Maxi. What happened to that? Well, I thought... The ice cave is so small. I'm just not gonna look at the map. We don't, I don't need. A, I don't need a map. I don't need. A, I, we don't have to ask for directions. It's okay. See, the power of being non-binary is that I can channel the worst traits of both uh, uh, perceived genders. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Siska says, fun fact, Gale's mom in Baldur's Gate 3 is still alive and knows what he did. Excuse me? Dude, watch out for the staircase. Oh, by the way, happy 413, by the way. I, although, I guess it's only in Australia, actually. Nomia, Nomia today is celebrating 413 by reading Homestuck, by the way. Which I think it's kind of hilarious. Yeah, S S S Siska is just absolutely the MVP. You, dude, there's four different kinds of enemies in the in that pack. Also, I'm not gonna go in here this time. I'm gonna go up the staircase because I'm not dumb. I'm a little dumb, but I'm not that dumb. Please don't turn anyone into stone. I would kindly request you don't turn anyone into stone. Perfect, Magni, everything went according to plan, and that got us out of here. Okay, so first off, we got a tent up. Now, I have to walk all the way back, and that town does not have potions, unfortunately. 
All right, so we need to find the dwarves. We've got to find the dwarves. We have to find the dwarves and we have to find Astos. No, not Astos. We have to find the, the, the golem, the ogre, the troll. We have to find a boy who's quite hungry. Who's hungry for delicious, delicious rubies. Here's an item shop. Oh my god. It's too true, though. Alright, I, I would like to purchase all of your heal items, please. You can't buy any more! Oh my god, please. If I do this, would you give me the maximum quality? No, oh my god. Okay, give me like... Okay, give me 70. How about that? Give me 70, huh? There we go. I'm so old. We're we're old. We're we're old, and that's okay. It's perfectly okay to be old. Okay, don't 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 dwell on that. Huh? Oh, what do I do here? I don't want to buy any of your stuff. It's time to just get moving. Very tight passages in this town. All right, we gotta we we have got to find. Isn't this Moto Matoyas? Matoyas? Ba -na 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 all right, so that's Matoya. Don't care. This is where we began. This is the this is where our story began. Oh, not so long ago. Ain't that lovely? Um, uh, let me double check that there's no like mountain gates that I missed on the top. I did not. Okay. Okay. Let's begin by checking the smaller areas first, such as the smaller island to the west of the mainland. are you? Oh, this is the el is this the oh this is the elf town. Okay. All right, that's the elf town. There's an elf castle town. Don't worry about it. Don't ask me about it. It's fine. I'm gonna assume that no matter what, the area that has the troll will be a mountain. It will look like a mountain no matter what. Much like the area with the dwarves will always look. Oh, come on. I feel it. This is good. Yeah, let's go. All right. Buddy, here you go, buddy. If you want to pass, give me the pear. Munch, munch, munch. Mmm, it tastes so sweet. Pears are my favorite. Yeah, yeah, you're good, buddy. All right, what's in here? The chime! Bingo! All right. I forget what the chime does, but that's good. Uh, cast ice. I, I don't care. One single gigabizzle. 26, 126 gigabizzles. Don't care. You could not make me interested. I wonder where this exit goes. The same place. No. This, this teleporter is across the whole map. Oh, no. Chime lets you enter the tower. Okay. Oh, and then the cube lets you go above. That makes more sense. Thank you, Dallas. I like that, that that hole just takes you across. That's kind of funny. Okay, so now we just, need, we just need to find the dwarf. The dwarves. Are you the town that has the dock to the side? You're the town that has the dock to the side, aren't you? No. It's not you. It might be you. It is you! Okay. Yep, yeah, yeah, whatever, man. Uh, I am Error. Well, nice to meet you, Error. Good for you. All right, so we have found. There's just a dragon living in that village. Well, I mean, like, I guess every village should have at least one dragon. So thankfully, now we know. And it, it is it is kind of landlocked. Let's be entirely honest. Hi, hi, Duppy. Welcome back. Welcome. How you doing, Dups? All right, so we have done the ogre, the troll, the man who wants the pear. We just have to find the place where the dwarves live. If we can find, we have we found it before. This might be it, actually. Or is this the Earth Cavern? This is the Earth Cave. All right, never mind. I am sleepy. That's okay. Are you? This is where the dwarves live. No, this is literally, I was here a second ago. Perfect. Maybe next time, 
I understand this has been no it's been noble. It's been a no a novel experience for me to like experience Final Fantasy 1 with a completely different map. Let's never do this ever again. Let's never shuffle the map ever again, okay? I like Corneria just is in a marshy island. That's kind of funny. So you're not here, so it means the dwarves have to be in the in the mainland. All right, well, let's begin the process of checking every single cave again. I will say for, you know, for as hard as this is, and it's not hard, this is where the dwarves live. There we go. No, this is where Sarda lives. All right. <gasps> Why, kitty? Is something happening at work? Is there trouble? Can it be a hole in the ground? Dallas, don't say that. If it's a hole in the ground, we are in trouble. I, I must assume... I assume that it must have... <gasps> he did? Is he in trouble? <gasps> no... The rumor's out. School's out. Like a student? Um, ooh, that's not good. All right. Time to... Ch no, no, I, I think I think it has to be a mountain. It has to be just like... It has to be just like in the, in the original game. It has to be a mountain. It can't be a hole. Yeah, because yeah, otherwise, like, you know, towns could lead into, like, mount... Like, uh, caves and stuff, right? That doesn't make any. This is Matoya. Where's the other one? Like I'm, I'm not opening the map willy nilly. By the way, are we flying with a little pixel ship? The whole game is pixels. So Fifi, hello. Welcome back. Welcome. <laughs> the whole game is is made of pixels. Oh, it's the waterfall that's highlighted. Have we gone into the waterfall? Are you winning? I think I'm doing a pretty good job at winning. I'm lost right now, but we're winning. Can we talk about this patch of nothing but mountains? Oh, here's where the dwarves live. There we go. Hey, hey, what's up? Okay, I think we got nothing from the robot. Okay. I vaguely remember doing that. All right, so this, this, this dwarf wants to blow up the continent, and I say, you know what? Do it. Oh, Oxyale! Let's go! Bingo! Alright, so now we have the Oxyale, which is the magic ingredient we need to be able to go under. So, we have no more checks. I guess we we really don't need the channel, but whatever, it's fine. Uh, so, all that's left... All that that's left for us to do is to... Yeah, all, all the four fiends are now available to do, so... I guess it's time to go do the Oxio. It's time to go into the water dungeon. All right, so I'm thinking, Oxio is Oxford plus Yale. Kitty, please, Kitty, please. This is this is um. Now, does Maxi remember where the town that has that needs the Oxio is? Fun fact. I totally do. It's this town. It's this town, the one that is pretty much landlocked. All right, so let's, you know what? We can actually just use the, the inn here, I think. Will this laugh be vanilla? That would be pretty funny if it was. All right. Don't forget to, to tip your cleaning lady, by the way. And with this, this lady invented a, uh, a submarine, but she needs something to be able to breathe underwater. Guess what? We have it. We have to go help the mermaids, by the way. And, the, and welcome! We are, we are now on, we are now in the underwater temple. And as we all know, every, everyone in gaming, everyone agrees, water temples are the best ones. Oh, we could, we could also do the Citadel of Trials, actually. Someone remind me to do that eventually. 
All right. Oh, that's so funny. Wait, no. Do we start at the top level? We don't. Oh my god. So where? There's nine different maps for this area. All right. Where are we in this map? I can't. I cannot find myself in level one. So we're not in level one. Are we in level five of this map? We're not in level five. Are we in level two? No. Are we in level two B? No. How about I just start wandering around? You know what? I bet I haven't actually entered the temple. That's what it is, isn't it? No, no. No, there's already sea trolls and lobsters here. I'm not particularly ex interested in fighting you guys. Uh, this guy's blind? Which I mean, like, you know, having only one eye... That, that would definitely make things a bit more difficult. Huh, this is strange. I, I don't recognize this area. Huh. You did kind of set yourself up for that, actually. Yeah, by... by... Oh, oh, okay. We start in level 3A. Oh, of course. Of course. Of course it's level 3A. Everyone knows that. Is there nothing in here? There, There's literally nothing in there, huh? I think we have to go up before we can go down. Uh, Thankfully, darkness only lasts until the end of battle. Now that I realize. I, by the way, uh, the name of that enemy is GR Shark. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be um, Great Shark, not Green Shark. But then again, what do I know? Not a lot of damage, which I'm happy about. Wow. Wow. Got, gotta love those. The we ran away and they were like, uh-uh. You're not going anywhere. I'm going to go up first. I have a faint feeling they want us to go up first. So that means we, we, we go into 4A, I think. Yes. Okay. There's nothing in this box. There is a chest up at this away. Let's fight some sharks. Let's fight some sharks. Why not? Nomia, lightning. No, Nomia, fire them up. Cook them real good. And can you use lightning, please? Well, okay, so we. I, th I, I don't know if I randomize the enemies. It would be funny if these guys are, like, actually not weak to electricity. Why do the sharks look like ninja turtles? You're not wrong. Now I can't unsee it, kitty. Way to go, kitty. Now I can't unsee it. Uh, everyone is fine. Just, just, just keep doing the mosh, okay? They're turtles. They're shark turtles. By the way, um, we went to an to an old like um, toy. No, not an old toy store, but like um, a store where they sold like you know like old toys, I guess. Um, and Kitty had Kitty did not remember Street Sharks, so uh, they had a, a great moment. <laughs> Heroes with that back fin, turtle power. No, not all Hot Wheels, but just like like old toys in general, like you know, like wrestling toys, and there were you know, like old Transformers, but they also had like um, you know, Street Sharks. You can't say old Street Sharks; is <laughs> they haven't made new Street Sharks. You need another toys? Dude, the Street Shark toys kind of went hard. Oh! Oh, oh, look at that! Wow! A, 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 a better cure item. That's nice. I'm happy there's one in the entire game. Uh, there's the chest this away. De Dale, look up a picture of Street Sharks. Computer, computer, bring up a picture of Street Sharks. Computer, can I have a printout of Oyster smiling, please? 1G. I will say, Street Sharks, I feel, inferred, like, 
so much of what makes a Plexworth character. Where's the door? Oh, it's around? In this weird, like, backward sea looking room? A tent? That's always good to, ha to have. And now there's one more room on the bottom right corner of the screen. Ghosts? Uh, I don't believe in ghosts, so you actually can't deal damage to me. And look at that, We're, we just walked away. This party of a bunch of sea hags, they just want to like come and say hi. And I'm just like, sorry, party's full. I'm in this corner. Uh, we go around, perfect. Another great, another street, <laughs> another street shark. A cabin. I know about street sharks, but it has, it was never aired in this country. Yeah, it's probably for the best. You wouldn't want to corrupt the youth of, of, of Germany with street sharks. Terrible, terrible street sharks. Uh, elf, is it L5 or LB? It's L5, okay. All right, oh, this one, oh, this is where all the mermaids are at. Oh, dude, biker mice from Mars. I love biker mice from Mars. You have responded, you have responded to me? Yeah, okay, yeah. Did I have the mod where I kill mermaids if I talk to them? Yeah, well, you know, I'm sure they'll be fine. Uh-uh, money, a ripoff weapon. More money, useless. <laughs> oh, don't forget about Skeleton Warriors. Wait, hold up. Does anybody remember that one cartoon where it was like Egyptian mummies? Was it, was it called the Oh No Mummies or something? That show kind of ruled, I'm sorry. That show kind of owned. Dude, that kind of owned. If something can make you trans as a raccoon, this is so true. Or is it like, 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 it might be called like, oh no, mummy's alive or something. That one, that, it's like, so just a bunch of, it's like gargoyles with their mummies. That's it. That's the whole setup. The whole setup is that they are, they are mummies. It, it, it's, it's the gargoyles Disney show, but instead they're just mummies. That's it. Yeah, it's called Mummies Alive! There we go. Thank you, kitty. Money. Money. And an F cure. That's nice. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Who here in chat? If I speak the hallowed words. If I speak his, his name. If I speak the real name of God. Will you know who I'm talking about? If I speak, if I speak his name, will, will you know him? If I say Beetleborgs, do you know what I'm talking about? Oh, dude, Beetleborgs went so hard. Oh no, kitty. Dude, dude, Beetleborgs is so stupid. Beetleborgs might be the dumbest thing. Straight up the dumbest thing. Uh, if, if you're multitasking at your computer, do me a favor. Uh, open a new tab. Don't close the video. Leave a like. Big Bad Beetleborgs, yeah! Open a new tab and open. find the, the opening theme to Big Bad Beetleborgs, okay? And just live react to it in chat. You have my permission to do so. Normally, we have rules of like, you're not allowed to, you know, have off topic conversations. Not today, baby, not today. Yeah, that, yeah, that, that, that was, that was Saban, Saban, Saban. I don't want to confuse him with my boy Saban. Okay, I think, yeah. Welcome to a room that is just here to waste your time, by the way. All these rooms are empty and you just want to go all the way to the top. If you want to rock and roll. Saving the wall. Now nah, listen now. Okay, now I go here. 
And now we go uh, loops a daisy. And now we go a uh, loops a malaise. A flame shield, don't care. A pure, a puree. Saban, weird ass music composer and toku <laughs> tokusatsu, toku tokusatsu importer. Saban would watch Beetleborgs. That's all I need to know. Thank you. Oh my god, that act that brings me so much relief. Oh, dude, pizza cat. Oh my god, I think about pizza cats all the time. On sarcastically, I think about pizza cats all the time. See, there is. There is, um, you know, part of the random access memory in my brain, part of my mental RAM, there, there is a, <laughs> there's a subroutine, can you tell I've been thinking about coding all day? There's a subroutine made entirely so that I can think about Samurai Pizza Cats and then also remember Super Samurai, Sa Samurai, no, Super Samurai Cyber Squad. Uh, Super Samurai Cyber Squad. The best part, though, is that Super Samurai Cyber Squad was so stupid, and yet someone really loved it enough to make it the continuation of the Gridman series. For more information, watch the, anim the anime uh, SSSS Gridman. Oh, this is where the eye was the entire time! Bye! You're familiar with Glitter Force? I am not. Or maybe I am. I mean, I'm old. I know everything. That's not true. I'm actually going to pick up that Temper Sword because I think uh, the strats for this is going to be to just um, give Siska Temper uh, and have Siska just kill everyone. So, uh, Maxi, you're going to drop your sap. And you're going to pick up the Temper Sword. Oh, it was a, it was a dub of Precure. I love that. It is kind of in their, ho in their wheelhouse. House wheel, huh? What does it mean when people say it's in their wheelhouse? What does that mean? No, really, I'm, I'm legitimately wondering. What does it mean? for it to be in your wheelhouse. There is, I'm a little bit concerned. There's one map. I I wasn't able to access this map. Oh no, I did. Okay, never mind. Never mind. I'm good now. All right. So um, we're onwards now to fighting the the Kraken. You're like, Maxi, you're running past the room, Maxi. Don't you want to go in there and grab all the chests? It's empty. It's empty. Much like the pro... I, I, I want to get that song. There's there's that one guy who does TikToks where, like, he opens up and there's, like, this dramatic song plays and, it's, and he just talks directly into the camera. I want to get that song. I want to download that song and I want to just play it whenever I'm just, like... It's like... Dun, 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 dun. It's like, yeah. Yeah, guess what? Guess what? That room is empty. There's nothing in there. It's empty, just like the just like the promises of the capitalistic kings of America. Trickle down economics. More like pay me a living wage. Oh, wait, is this room just a trap? It's not a trap. It is kind of a trap. I will say though, uh in in, in the case of in, in the case of all of all these rooms. Let me go. Thank you. This room particularly is the one that looks the most like it's the back rooms, by the way. Because you have you enter this giant room, right? And inside this room, there's a bunch of just rooms with no doors and no windows and no way for you to access them. And the answer for you to get out of here is to, just to literally, like, take a turn and walk through a random door. All I'm saying is that there's there's some liminal spaces happening here. All right. It's another name for pilot houses, Dallas, which is where the steering wheel is in the ship. Ah! Which evolved into a metaphor for an area of general ge area of general command, which turned into an idiom, apparently. 
Ah. Ah, thank thank God, Kitty. I love Bob. I would hate for him to to do. <laughs> I I would I would hate for him to do anything bad. All right, everyone. Um, we fought Karen. Now unleash the Kraken, as they say. The fiend's ball is shattering, evaporating all the water. Ho ho ho! How foolhardy to dare to challenge me, Kraken, the fiend of the water. Oh, it 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 looks to me like like the. It looks like they dipped him, like they he, they dipped him in guacamole. That's what he looks like. They cooked the kraken and then they they just they dipped him in guacamole. That is literally what I'm seeing right now, by the way. Mmm, delicious guacamole. Ah, that makes more sense actually. Cast fast on yourself, then you're gonna cast fire on him. Tomato freak. Yeah, they, yeah, I respect that. Now cast temper on Siska and then cast temper on Siska. Siska's going to deal so much damage. And Noms is about to die. It's fine. It's fine because Nomi is going to is going to heal themselves. Nomi is going to take some time to heal themselves and everyone's just literally going to just heal. He does look like a gummy worm. It's true. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Bingo! Bingo! Siska came in dealing 800 damage. Let's go. Cool. Oh, Nomia died? When did Nomia die? Oh, well. All right. We got the bubbly one. We have the the, the water the water orb. All right. We, we did it. What was the item that we got in there? We got an item in there. The chime? We got the chime. Okay. I mean, like, literally, all that's left for us to do is just to literally go to, uh, the ta- We could do the- Oh, we could do the Tower of Trials, I guess. There could be something in there. It could be- It's probably the loot, really, for all we know. I needed the damage. I've been fighting this boss for 10 hours. Oh, my God. I need the damage. I've been fight. Oh, my God. Siska, what boss have you been fighting for 10 hours, Siska? Is the boss capitalism? I don't think we got anything other than than the than the orb. I guess not. I'm gonna go to the I'm, I'm gonna go to the castle of trials. We're gonna go to the castle of trials. We're gonna go do that. We're, we're gonna go do it. It's gonna be okay. I can't believe Plague and I ended up dipping into that voice yesterday. <laughs> we're just doing our terrible impression. It's north of this away. No? I went too far north. They can't re they can't be two castles literally back to back, right? So that's the ruined castle. Oh my god, it's you, isn't it? It it's it's slab slab into the, the loot, probably. Alright, welcome to the what are you called again? The Citadel of Trials. Good. Let's just do the Citadel of Trials. The only door we care about is this one, this away. And now we we are... By the way, fun fact. I'm going to tell you a little secret, by the way. I don't want to spoil Lice of P for you. <gasps> is it Geppetto? Is it Geppetto? Is it Geppetto? Is it Cheepito? Okay. By the way, the... the so fun fact, uh, welcome to the Isle of Trials, uh, Castle of Ordeals, whatever. Uh, in this, this is a teleporter maze. Uh, you always want to take the pillar that's on the bottom. That's it. You always want to take the pillar that's on the bottom. If there's one on the bottom, you want to take that pillar. Except for that one time. Sorceress? Oh, Nomi is still dead. All right, yeah, maybe I should have like thought about that. You know, actually, you know what? You know what? It's fine because I know, I know the hidden magics to revive people from the dead, and then I'm gonna heal Nomi, and there you go. Everything's fine. And we keep taking the one that's on the bottom, and that looped me back around. Am I incorrect in my assessment then? 
Is it this one? No. Oh, there's a chest here. Uh, we, we did the we did the displacement love, yeah. Ten hours may sound like a lot, but but back when Elden Ring came out, I spent a whole month attempting Malena. Oh Jesus Christ! That seems like a lot, dude. Which oh, it's the portal all the furthest away, isn't it? It's fine. We did do this area, by the way. The thing is, is that when we did this area, I just gave you all the answers. Okay, so it's not... Are they randomized? Don't tell me they're randomized. P place. Oh, no. Oh, no. I think they're... Guys, I think they're randomized. That's bad. That's bad. Oh, no, no, never mind. We made it. <laughs> cool. cool. I'm a clown. I'm a clown. I'm an abs... I'm, I'm, I'm a clown. The Sphinx? Nah. Yo, really? The, the, sorry, it, it's it's really funny to hear Siska mention, you know, Northern Loin. I'm actually kind of surprised. Experiencia. Sap, don't care. The ca we found the canal! It's not needed for anything. This box is empty. I don't want to fight zombies. Don't tell me I have to go. Okay, all right. So there was nothing in the castle of ordeals, by the way. There was a canal, sure. But what am I supposed to do with that? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dan Giesling was the one with a th over a thousand attempts. P poor Dan. Poor Dan Giesling. All right, so what? So uh, we just have to go do the... I guess we just go to this lab, huh? Yeah, we're missing this lab and the, and, the, and the loot. The loot, which is required, by the way. The key in Cornelia Castle? I'm pretty sure we opened everything. I'm pretty sure we went back to Cornelia and opened everything. I legitimately feel like it's probably gonna be just in, in, in the desert. It's gonna be in the in the in the, uh, the Mirage Tower. So let me go to Provoca. Let me go stay at the inn. No, no. Yes, I ran. I I did randomize the <laughs> the, the shops in Provoca. Unfortunately, like. You're like Maxi. Why can't you just like rush be in the game now? We need we need the loot. We actually need the loot. The Tower of Mirage and the Flying Fortress. This is the the longest dungeon in the entire game. We could finish the game today though, and I would like to. So onwards we go. Thankfully, we know where the uh, where the tower is. It's been taunting us since the beginning of the game. It's literally right at this away. There is a park, a place we can park our, our ship right here, and onwards we go. No dinos, no dinos, just the sandworm. Shout out to Kendra, by the way, and all the dune heads out there. All right. Mirage Tower level one, two, and three. Let me open those maps so that we waste even less time. Oh, wait, no. Wouldn't you want to talk to the dragon here? <laughs> Hi, Kendra. Oh my god, freaking nerd. Batman! Bad, do you see that enemy is just called Batman? The Chimera? I can't even process this monster, by the way. Aw, Bob is so nice. Ah, uh, casts fire, don't care. Silver ring, don't care. Money, don't care, don't care. Just a steel helmet, buddy. We we have had the best equipment in the game from like la like two weeks ago. Money. And that's that's it, huh? Oh no, you're at last. Another blast powder, don't care. Hello, Mr. Robot. Are you the master? Nope. 
Shout out to the trans chimera. Okay, can we please appreciate uh, this uh, Kamen Rider looking MFR? Just called Batman. Sir, you're supposed to be riding the horse, not fighting alongside it. Alright, that's the first level of this place. Done. The second level. There's another little robot here. You have to go all the way around. Yeah, you're like, oh, I can get in there. No, you can't. And and now the go oh yeah yeah there's actually there's robots in this game by the way. That's right. Final Fantasy One introduced some science fictiony elements. There's robots. There's an implication that like this was built by a higher civilization that went extinct at some point. Might have been the elves. Who knows? The Cerberus attack first. Don't care. Not my problem. Maxi, they're attacking you. It is your problem. Can we stop to analyze, by the way, the fact that Kitty has more maximum health than a ninja and a monk? Don't care. Don't care. Rip off. Don't care. That's not ribbon, right? This is just—it's just this rip off. Okay. Uh, another temper weapon. Eh. Nope. A bunch of money. Don't care. Three gold. Three gigabizzies. And another thunder two weapon. Don't care. All right. We're going to take this door. We're going to go back around. Say hi to the robot. My con may be bad, but my HP is boosted. I love that. Catman. Saber T. Trans Sabers. And Catman. Dude, when will Catman and Batman team up? Hello, Mr. Robot. One of us escaped with the cube. He floated far to the west. Oh, really? Yeah, let me actually appreciate... I'm appreciating the trans chimera, actually. I'm not going to fight it, because you know what? We're on the same team. And last, but by no means least, is the Mirage Tower. And you're like, Maxi, we're done. No, we're not done. This is the... the we're not... Dude, we... We haven't even had the dungeon yet. A blue D? It's not supposed to be blue. Fun fact, if it looks blue, you it probably shouldn't. Uh, fire, can I cast fire? Cast temper on Siska, so Siska can take care of it literally in the next one. Unless Siska kills it in one hit. Siska did <laughs> Siska's got it. Requires a cube? Dude, I've got a cube right here. Alright, so now, guess what? We're in the future now. Cast temper on me so I don't get tilted? Dude. You got this, Siska. I've been staying very calm all this time. Did you really spend a whole month fighting Mil fighting Melania? Melania? Melanie? Whatever her name is. Flops on you. Dude, no, no. I want to flop on Siska. Protect plus five. It resists death. Eh, you know what? My plan is just to not get hit by the death spell. How about that? Uh, a green Medusa wants to fight. Money. Don't care. Don't care. I'm just looking for a loot. I'm looking for a loot. And a slap. I'm the temper spell. Dude. Could you imagine? Mithril? Oh, plus, I thought it was a plus 20. A tent. Don't care. 31 gigis. Don't care. Alright. Buddy, all we're missing is just that goddamn loot. By the way, yes, it's implied we're in space, by the way. Like in some sort of like satellite. Maybe? Okay, level two. There is a few. This was a time I only had two to four hours to myself every day, and my PC broke down twice that month. Woof. Man, would I have the patience to do that? Because, like, I, I own Elden Ring. I didn't get very far, and a part of me is like, should I go back and play Elden Ring? But I'm like, I don't... I don't, I don't know if I want to spend a month trying to, like, beat one boss. Yeah, we only beat the first boss. 
Can a game have too much to do? People in chat, I'm asking you a philosophical question. Can a video game have too many things to do? Go. Before I even offer my own feelings, I want to let you tell me what you think. Yes, says Doppy. Yes, I'm an adult. I don't have infinite time anymore. They all says depends. I, 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 I don't know. Like, a part of me is like, is there too much content in Elden Ring? Because, like, like, I don't want to make you think that I only played, like, two hours of Elden Ring. We put in, like, 15, maybe 20 hours because we were exploring everything. And we're like, we should probably do the first boss. And then we kind of just fell off. We just got busy doing other things. And a part of me is like, maybe my my resistance is because I I can't envision myself spending months playing just one game. I, I hop between things for research. So a part of me is like, I, I don't envision myself ever being like, yeah, I'm going to spend just a month playing Elden Ring. Chibi says they get completionist about it. Yeah, th that's fair. I mean, like, a part of me is like... Like, I would be pissed if I had done this before, but, like, I'm missing... I was missing two Stardew Valley achievements. I was missing two. And now they added so much more. They added a bunch of new achievements, and I'm like, oh, God. They they've, they've done F'd me up. Oh, uh, let's go. By the way, I, I do remember, by the way, fun fact. When Kitty and I played Elden Ring, we fought the rune bear near the beginning. The elder rune... Oh, a phoenix down! Um, the the rune bear, by the way, that mf -er, uh, he fell through the world and, and, and on a life himself. Literally, we're fighting him, and I'm like, I'm doing a good job. I'm fighting, I'm doing my best, and then the guy just falls through the world. And I'm like, alright, that's the Elden Ring experience. And then we got stuck! Oh yeah, 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 no, no, he didn't die! Yeah, we had to fight him again! He didn't count as killing him! Tiamat is the fiend of, fiend of the wind. I don't care. Yo, does, does this computer play Minecraft? These are all computers! Hell yeah, I, 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 I like that, Chippy. The wizard vampire, the vampire wizard, wizard of the vampires. It is interesting, because like I, I like to look at um, achievements on video games just to get a feeling for you know what people did when they played, and like strangely enough, like it is interesting seeing that like oh the, the loot was here the entire time. Bingo! All right, we got the loot. Uh we we actually don't need this lab by the way. We don't need this lab. Return this lab. Uh uh, it's mine now. All right, and now welcome to uh, the worst part in the whole game. Um, this may appear to be an infinite maze, uh, but you literally just go meh, 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 meh. No. Oh no. Oh, I made it. Okay. <laughs> it's a man cat. You hit me with cat man and then man cat? Listen, I don't have time to deal with no man cats, okay? Uh, Siska, you're making me want to play Elden Ring. God damn it, Siska. I don't have time to play Elden Ring. And yeah, they. So, fun fact um, there is one super boss in the entirety of Final Fantasy 1. It is called um, Death Machine? Death Machine? Uh, there is a battle robot you can fight in here. Uh, it only appears naturally on this bridge. It is like a r super rare encounter. It is the hardest boss in the whole game. Let's hope. Let's hope I don't activate nothing. Because I would not like to fight uh, Death Machine, Machine Death. I would not like to fight that MFR right now. 
He's stronger than the final boss in this game. Although, truth be told, we could be fighting the final boss in like 15 minutes. We made it. All right, all right. Everybody, you can stop holding your breath. <laughs> no, it's not kidding. My mouse on the screen? No, it's not. Lightning erupts from the from the fiend's ball. So you have come this far. I, Tiamat, the fiend of the wind, will now put an end to your adventure. I am. am I, I'm gonna do us a favor, by the way. I'm gonna do us a favor. I'm just. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna set a safe state just in case. <laughs> so this guy says, "Hey, if you're up for Elden Ring. I can hop on as co-host." Oh my god. Siska says, I'll sit on your shoulder and tell you you did well every time you beat a boss. Should I make a... You know what I should do? I should make little, like, um... Just like I have the little Moogle buddies. I should make little buddies of all my friends. So I can be like, today I feel like having Siska on my shoulder. Today I feel like having... So-and-so on my shoulder. So give yourself fast, Siska. Uh, Nomia, uh... Just cast fire on Tiamat. By the way, Tiamat looking like a red dragon, by the way. Tiamat is supposed to be, like, green. Like, teal, by the way. Cyan? Alright, are we dead? We're... We're... We, Nomia took a lot of damage. Nomia took a lot of damage. Uh, Nomia, I'm gonna have to ask you to heal yourself. I'm gonna be healing Nomia as well. And, Kitty, you are... Uh, swing your hammer around. Ooh, fire too. Not the best, but we're getting there. Yeah, 900 damage is pretty good. 900 damage is pretty good. I I think we'll, I think we'll I think we'll get there. I think we'll get there. Especially cuz I don't think the boss can out heal us. I don't think he can out heal us. Ooh, even if those are pre-damaging spells. There we, there we go. Bingo. Easy peasy lemon squeezing. Hey, hey, you know what Tiamat is in D and D lore? It, it, isn't yeah, isn't it? Isn't it one of the deities you can be like a cleric of? Can you be? Can't you be a cleric of Tiamat? And that's it. That's, that's the Wind Fortress, baby. I hope I didn't forget to pick up the the orb. I didn't! All right. Bingo! Fellas, all that's left for us to do is to legitimately just uh, go find the Chaos Shrine and Queen uh, queen and Goddess of all Chromatic Dragons, Archdevil of Avernus. Freaking nerd. <laughs> Freaking nerd. You're a nerd. Nerd. That's pretty cool, though. All right, we're... Okay, uh, Yanto, where did you leave the Chaos Shrine, Yanto? Just play the sound, okay? Which one? Which one? Oh, yeah. Wait, I got an epic dragon, mommy? There you go. That's the one you wanted. She's a mother, okay? It's really changed her perspective. No, there's no way... A part of me is like, should I play Elden Ring on stream? I don't know if I should. It might bring in a different crowd of people. <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm bad at games. I am feeling like more more RPG, so this was fun. You're just Cornelia. This is just Cornelia Castle. Where did I leave the Chaos Shrine? Wasn't it north of this away? Okay, I have loop. Are you the Chaos Shrine? Are you my mommy? There we go. All right. Let me just go find the Temple of Chaos. Oh my god. So, welcome. We have all the pieces that we need. And um, the four orbs now cover the black orb. To take a step forward is to go back 2,000 years in time. That's right. This game features a time loop. Am I going to explain it? No. 
Uh, we're literally good to just go. Which stake am I supposed to take? It doesn't matter. Perfect. I'll take the one nearest to me. It does matter. The only path is the one down. Okay, perfect. Alright, next level of... Okay. Big ol' empty room. Big ol' empty room. I can't get out. All right. Yeah, I might not want soul soul heads coming in. Souls he souls heads. Okay, I appear to have misunderstood which way to get up here. I mean, you know, I've probably only been in this dungeon like you know, I don't know, like three times in my life. Siska makes a really good point though. A uh, part uh, like. The fun part of Souls game is never ever interacting with the community. This is a fair point. It is so incredibly true. Man, oh, the, the fire nunchucks are really letting us down. Holy crap, that was no damage. Although, thankfully, you know. Siska's gonna do what Siska does. By which I mean, you know, swing their uh, moon Moonlight Sword and just destroy everything. What if I go up the other way? Oh my god, you you really do be hitting me with- I mean, I guess this is the, the actual final ass dungeon, huh? Where did that Syracuse even lead to? Wait, hold up, hold up. I guess I guess I go this way. Which takes me here. Is that level two? It is level two. Oh my god. Then I have to go. Where do I go? Oh I, I, I go around I go around. I go around. Okay, perfect. Perfect, magnifique. There's a stone plate on the floor. You send something evil? No, 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 no. You're don't tell me that I need this lab. What is this lab needed for? Please, for the love of God. Final Fantasy 1 slab. Please. Oh my God, please. Don't don't tell me I need the... Maybe this is nothing. Maybe this is nothing. Maybe this is nothing. Max, are you afraid, Max? I'm a little afraid. Is there nothing on this level? Am I crazy? Is it literally just this? Sorry, I have the map open on my other screen. I'm, I'm looking for like, where is the ladder? There's, this just leads nowhere, huh? Actually, fellas, considering how we are li gas D, considering how we're literally, you know, in the final hours of this uh, playthrough, What's a game you would like for me to play? I always take recommendations. Yeah, again, my my own my only my only thing right now is that I am designing a fantasy game, so I would like it to be a fantasy RPG, perhaps, mayhaps. That is literally all I ask for. So like Dark Souls would actually kind of be on the money. But I'm also like, you know, I'm bad at games. But then again, what if I did though? DOS. Uh, Siska says I would love to see you uh, to see you play through DOS one. What's DOS one? 
You can DOS these nuts. Oh. I, I, I'm, ju I was, I'm just prepared for it. I'm just prepared for it. Oh, Divinity Original Sin. Oh. That would, that, I feel like that's probably it. Unless Siska just wants me to just boot up DOS. M DOS? MS DOS? Alright, I'm back to level one. Level one is nothing. Level one is this one. We do have the second game, we do. Am I dumb? Mm, 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 mm. You will see blah 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 the past version. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. It doesn't say anything about needing me to have this lab, but I just, I'm looking at this map and I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Jokova Racing is cute. Yeah, I would have to buy it, but it is cute. Okay, so I have gone up that away. But well, yeah, I mean. Max, there's really only two staircase leading up, so you know what that means? Take the other freaking staircase. Good old process of elimination. By the way, Worms, shoutouts to all my Dune hats, by the way. Some Frosty Ds. Frosty? Ice cream? Kitty, we should have ice cream. We should, we should get ice cream on our date. All right, fellas, this leads nowhere. This is absolutely leading nowhere. Okay, so it's not this way. It has to be this one here. I swear to God. I swear to God, I, I am, I'm so terrified. I'm so terrified. Oh, really? <laughs> Oh my god, Kendra. Okay, that's it. We're scouting this entire we're scouting this entire level now, because it's gotta be here. No, it's not this map, it's this map. No. Is it is this the is it the earth level? No. I feel like I'm still literally in like the first part of the dungeon. Sorry, I'm like, I'm like straight up legitimately lost right now. There we go. Okay, okay. It's definitely here. Where's the staircase? There is no staircase. Guys. I actually think we need this lab. Let me really quickly. I'm gonna check really quickly, by the way. Uh, FF1. Uh, is this the chaos? Temple of Fiends. Temple. Temple of Fiends. Stone. Plate. Unless I have to use an item. Am I supposed to use like the chime? I mean, you know, I, I guess you know, might as well just o just open the just open the menu, Max. All right, item, the chime. No, the loot. Oh my god, <laughs> it was the goddamn loot. All right, at I at least I figured it out. At least I figured it out. At least I'm at least I'm not as dumb as everyone thinks I am. That's not true, I am. Well, thankfully the problem has been fixed. Now I know what to do now. We go in here. We criss we crisscross now this away. <laughs> oh really? Dude, hell yeah, Kendra. That sounds fun. I love that. All right, now I'm now I'm where I want it to be. That's where I wanna be. All right. Nope. 
Is it level two? No, 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 the background is black. Is it the Earth Temple area? It is, okay, thank God. We've made it to the Earth Temple now, okay. So we have to refight all of the fiends, by the way. Why? Because it's an old game. You know, they have they had, they had to reuse those sprites somehow, okay? Anyone who calls my wife dumb is getting one of these. And then Kitty posted the sign of the knife. Hey, it's Lich! Hey, Lich! Looking like a little, like, weird little troll-looking guy. Uh, guess what? We're gonna hit you with the with the Siska Classic, also known as Buffing Siska. Until they just completely destroy you. Oh, really? <laughs> Kendra. <laughs> All right, and who needs healing? E everyone just stop off, honestly, because this is free healing. It's free real estate. All right. Did you see Siska did 1,401 damage? Excuse me? All right, so I think we're, we're in pretty good shape. So that's the earth. That's the earth floor. We're moving over to the fire floor. Is the floor lava? No. Uh, so I'm, I am, where am I in the map? Oh, I opened the wrong window. It's the Fiends of Fire. There we go. All right, so I'm in, I'm dead center. I don't care about chests no more, so the path is. Ooh, so I'm, I'm, I'm looking at the map and I'm like, how do I get around? Oh my god, I have to go all the way around. Okay, yeah. Got it, got it. I'm pretty sure that when I, when I cross, when I step into, um... Excuse me? Oh, this is bad. Nomia, just run, Nomia. Nomia, run. Alright. See, we all took a bunch of damage, but that's okay. Uh, The one who needs the most healing is me. Gamer, should I have another cup of decaf? Kitty, you have my permission to have another cup of decaf. Uh, cause, cause, you know, we, we are an understanding couple, and much like I understand you want some more decaf, and I, I know that you will understand that me, uh, remaking my game in, uh, in Godot would be good, so. <laughs> uh, by the way, as soon as I cross into this, this threshold, by the way, Karen's gonna show up again, I think. What's wrong? What's wrong, Ronnie? No, it was the next one. Okay, never mind. This is what being in a committed relationship is like, you know? You just understand one another. Okay, which door leads me to where I want to go? It's this one. Hey, a free chest. Money. We didn't find a single katana the whole playthrough, by the way. Which is kind of funny. Oh, never mind. We ended up going to the place that has it. That would have had the katana. <laughs> oh my god, Kendra. Okay, what, what if I... Clearly, you want me to go the other way then, right? Alright. Am, am I drunk? Where's the exit out of this floor? This is just chests, baby. Oh my god, Kendra. Also, fellas, once again, uh, I am taking recommendations for games I should maybe play. Now, the, the, the problem is that Sis Siska. Okay, so I'm I'm gonna I'm I'm telling you I'm telling you guys a little bit of behind the scenes, okay? So, I'm thinking for Thursdays when Plague and I hang out on stream, I'm thinking I want to do a one-on-one -on -one role playing campaign with Plaguesworth. And legitimately, my plan, I was, I'm, my plan is to sell Plaguesworth on doing a a, a, a role-playing campaign. That that that, Plague doesn't know this, but it's basically, it's going to be Dark Souls One, but I'd never tell him it's Dark Souls One. 
and everyone is a Muppet. <laughs> that, that, that is literally my plan for the D&D campaign. Maxi, are you going to change the names? No, no, no. It's still going to be Anor Londor. It's still going to be uh, Lordaeron. It's still going to be Firelink Shrine. Am I dumb? Oh, I am dumb. I am dumb. I am dumb. Please feel free to uh, make a, a uh, montage of all the times I walk past the damn staircase leading up, by the way. <laughs> Kendra says, it's like that icebreaker question. What movies improve if all characters but one are Muppets and which character stays human? There is Karen. Hi, Carrie. All right. I probably should have, like, prepared myself to fight you, but it's fine because this guy's fast. And Nomia, Nomia is going to, Nomia is going to just, like, cast fire on you. And, and again, Kitty and I, we're cheering for Siska. We're like, go, Siska, go. Siska's fast. Siska's on, on her lane. And as always, uh, Nomia has taken damage once again. So let's, let's, everyone heal Nomia. Everybody patting Nomia on the back. Uh, this is because I keep thinking about starting a D&D &D campaign on the side with you and some others, but also, when would I even prepare for that? The thing is... See, here's the dealio, okay? I think it would be fun if we did, like... A, ca a, a campaign... Uh, a co-op campaign... Uh, or one with, uh... Where the uh, the GM or the game master didn't have to prep things in advance, because that that is one piece of inequality that I don't particularly like in role playing games, where like you know, one specific player is required to do a lot more of the heavy lifting. Me looking at this screen right now, like where do you want me to go? Oh, there's rooms. They put rooms in here. Have you played Disco Elysium? I haven't. Legitimately, I don't I don't know if I would like Disco Elysium. I don't know if I would like it. I I, I know I, I know people who love it. Zeku likes it, liked it. As as did I forgot to heal up before Kraken. Uh, as does, uh, Cade. I think you would. Maybe. Maybe I would. Uh, unfortunately, uh, I, I, as I mentioned, you know, I'm working with fantasy right now, so I want to stay in that mind space. So yeah, on Saturday, I'm going to talk to Blake's where I'm going to be like, what if we did a campaign? A and I'm, I'm not going to tell him it's Dark Souls. <laughs> And it's, it's, it's just going to be Dark Souls. And I'll be using some systems for my current uh, working project, so I'm not having to make a whole engine or anything. Nomia, heal yourself again. Maxi, just like... Just like cast more temper on Siska. It just makes Siska even more powerful. That wasn't as much damage, Siska. I'm not going to lie to you, but it's okay you have a second turn coming in. Hell yeah, let's go. Dude, we're gonna we're gonna beat the game today. We're absolutely beating the game today. We have the heals. We got the damn Damash. And with that, oh my god. I can almost taste it. I can almost taste it. Oh really? That's fun, kitty. Okay, we have the air level map and then we're done. Uh and there is one okay, there's one last chest. Let's go get it. There's one last chest in this entire game. Let's go get it. That's okay. Thank you, Ronnie. So that that chest 
uh, position usually contains the katana, which is the strongest melee weapon that everyone can equip. So you can give a katana to your, you know, to your white mage as as nature intended. What about the Atelier games? Well, we, we did play, we did play Risa because Ronnie recommended it, and Risa was really good. Okay, so, um, Tiamat is in this little hallway here, by the way, so I'm gonna heal up. Slay the princess, huh? I, I've, I've seen that on, on, the, Ste on the Steam uh, front page. What, is it a visual novel or is it like a, what, what is it? By the way, I, I knew that Tiamat was there, by the way. You're gonna have to get up a little early in the morning to get me with that, Tiamat. What does Rub even do? Okay, maybe, this is not the time to cast spells you don't know what they do, Maxi. Just cast fire on the guy, it's fine. If only we had a fourth temper item, we could... <laughs> a third temper item. Uh, I guess it's actually a fourth temper item, but whatever. Uh, we could actually, you know, give it to uh, Noms, and then we could all just cheer. Nuke? Yeah, that was a lot of damage, but uh, at the same time, I'm not particularly worried because we have heals. So, uh, heal you. Heal yourself. Wait, hold up. Who, who did I tell you to heal? Heal me. I heal my wife. My wife heals all of us. Mm, dead in one turn? That was, that was 1400. It's a visual novel, but it's narrated, so don't worry. Interesting. Fellas. Fellas, yeah. Fellas, yeah. Has your girlfriend got the butt? Tell her to shake it, shake that healthy butt, baby got back. All right, so welcome. This is the final room in the game. Uh, it's a big old circle. In the original version of this game, uh, this room is actually a pe a, uh, a, uh, a pentagram. Uh, but for the English release, they just made it a triangle because we all know triangle is the real evil. Triangles are evil. That's uh, If you don't understand why, read the fabulous case. Uh, all right, so uh, Dale, you're talking about "Baby Got Back" by Sir Mix a lot, also known as the song that Nicki Minaj remixed for Anaconda. My Anaconda don't, my Anaconda don't, my Anaconda don't want n none unless you got buns, love. This boy named Troy used to live in Detroit. Big back full of money? No. There's one line that, 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 like, sorry, so, so, you're like, Maxi, you know Nicki Minaj songs? I know, like, three. The other one, the other, okay, the other Nicki Minaj song that I know, let me open it real quick. It is, um, uh, Super Freaky Girl. The lyrics, by the way. Do you have the lyrics for the song? You don't. Okay. There's a lyric. There's a lyric in Super Freaky Girl that I really like. Like, I, I, I. I just, I, I, I sing this to myself, okay? Um, one thing about me, I'm the baddest alive. He, no, the prettiest bitch didn't come until I arrive. I don't let bitches get me. I fuck they man if they try. I got a princess face, a killer body, samurai mind. That is, I, like, I think about that, I think about that lyric all the freaking time. I got a princess face, a killer body samurai mind and i'm like yeah that's me that's me baby she wrote that song about me that song is about me anyways uh let's go defeat chaos all right so what was the story of this game maxi i don't get it i don't get it so um the story that you would learn that you would have picked up in this game uh back in the day is that let me just say um safe slot safe state create a safe state please Safe state. There you go. Um, there's a time loop going on here. Uh, the Garland that the the Fort Fiends sent Garland back in time. Yes, the first guy we ever fought. So he would have two thousand years to grow powerful and send the the Fiends to the future. 
uh, creating a weird time loop where basically, no matter what, at a certain point in time, the world starts falling into ruin because all the energy of the world is being sapped into feeding the fiends, and the fiends throw the world asunder. And now here we are to end the loop. Remember me, Garland? Your puny lot thought it had defeated me, but the four fiends sent me back 2,000 years into the past. From here, I send the four fiends to the future. The fiends will send me back to here, and the time loop will go on. He really did just clarify it, huh? After 2,000 years, I will be forgotten, and the time loop will close. I will live forever, and you shall meet your doom. Welcome? <laughs> it's a final fight against chaos! Alright. I do feel... We probably do need, like, a boss fight. Let me go find... Okay. What's a good what's a good indie RPG that won't sue me? Uh Dicey Dungeons. Actually, you know what? You know what? What about what about um um What about I mean Dicey Dungeons has has music in it? Where is the song against the uh, Against the Final Boss? It's not finale, is it? No, is it this one? No. The showdown. No. There we go. All right. Welcome to our real battle theme. This is Fortune Favors the Bold by Chipsol from the Dicey Dungeon soundtrack. Let's go. First off, Siska, make yourself fast. Nomia, preemptively heal yourself. Maxi, temper Siska. Kitty, temper Siska. Fire three? Instantly not too bad, actually. All right, Siska, you immediately start hitting. Nomia, I want you to heal Maxi. They're the ones who are the lowest. Um, Kitty, no, myself, we're still tempering Siska. We're gonna temper Siska to the max. Chaos takes 400 damage, not bad. Curing, curing myself takes me to the top, perfect. Siska hit again. Nomia, you're gonna, you're gonna preemptively cure me. Uh, I am going to temp, I'm going to temper Siska. Kitty's going to cast heal on all of us. A thousand damage, that's not bad. Okay, we're staying top top. This final boss could cast any spell. He could literally cast insta death on all of us, which would be bad. That would be bad. Okay, so I'm thinking, uh, preemptively actually heal yourself. Maxi, uh, temper Siska again, and Kitty cast heal on all of us. Uh, 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 uh. That's it! <laughs> <laughs> there we go there we go easy peasy lemon squeezy shout outs to the members of the party shout outs to Siska, Nomia Maxi and my lovely wife thank you thank you thank you thank you Bingo! we did it we did it let's, go. let's pop back to Lophilia let's pop back to Lophilia There we go. And that's it. That's Final Fantasy 1 with everything randomized. And custom sprites. There you go. Version 4.9.4.7.9, which got updated actually since the last time that I uh that I made this. Hey Warriors, thanks for defeating Chaos. Let's go for a burger. Ha ha ha. That's so funny. That that, that this was edited by the way. This is not what the original ending of the game is, by the way. Oh, movement stats! 26,000 steps, 13 resets. Uh, 51 times I couldn't... O oh, I only opened 150 out of 241 chests. Dude, we only died six times. Hell yeah. Combat stats, we dealt a bunch of damage. Dude, we only took like about half the damage we... We, we received half the damage we dealt, that's not bad. Yeah, 
let's let's play this out. Let's give a shout out to the people who made this game happen. Who made this randomizer happen? Hey, the original team, Nasir. And of course, the the original team, of course, you know, Yoshida Kamano. The Square A team! Ugh. There we go. Fellas, we're done early. I mean, I probably should end the stream early because I need to go on a date with my wife today. Mm. I don't know. What do y'all think? We're going to do dailies for sure. But other than that, I'm pretty much free today. Chrono Trigger Randomizer went, oh my god. I, I want to play Chrono Trigger on stream. I think that would be fun. But... I don't know if I'm ready for that. That was fun! Video essays to run? Oh my god. How dare you? Alright. A part of me is like, cut it, Max, not let it run! Let it run! These people work hard to make this happen. And shoutouts to the entire Final Fantasy Randomizer community, by the way. Fun fact, if if you watched this and you thought, man, I want to watch more Final Fantasy Randomizer stuff, guess what? They're starting a new, a new uh, leak literally right now. If you are interested in the Final Fantasy Randomizer community, please check out their channel. They're uploading literally every single day. Uh, they're running through the boot camp where they're teaching people how to play the game. If that interests you, check that out. I think. Oh, there it is. The end. Oh, my God. <laughs> Delightful. Uh, yeah, this has been the Final Fantasy no Final Fantasy 1. Fully randomized. This is not the this is not the the flag the flag set that they used for the runs, by the way. This is just one that I came up with. I wanted it to be kind of casual and silly, and it definitely was. And yeah, here we go. Now, normally, it would be, it would be playing the Final Fantasy theme right now. This is still pretty nice, though. And that's it. That's the end. I wonder if... I wonder if there's... In Final Fantasy IX, there's a little mini game where you can, like, play, like, Blackjack, but I'm pretty sure that's not, that's not here. Dude, what if I played some Balatra? Eh, we'll probably just do dailies and call it early. And that's it! <laughs> that is Final Fantasy 1 Randomized! Thank you for watching. Bingo. Bingo! And one more time. Mission complete! Alright, we did it. Let me close this. Let me close all these windows. And I guess it's time to- let's do dailies early. Let's do some dailies uh, early. So I'm gonna close you. We're gonna open the big presentation window and we're gonna boot up. Uh, it is the Firefox Presents mode. Let's go. I do wanna say, by the way, um, I do wanna say that Ronnie and Nomia are streaming later today, by the way. I gotta mute that tab as fast as possible. Uh, I think Ronnie is playing more sentiment today, me think. Sentiment? Pentiment! No, it's sleepover stream! The, today, there's a sleepover stream over at Ronnie's place, exclamation mark, moon tomes. Uh, Ronnie, what are you playing today, Ronnie? And also, Nomia will be reading, uh, doing a dramatic reading of, um, of, um, uh, Homestuck. It's Moonglow Bay, baby. Let's go. So there's stuff for you to watch if you want more of the stuff that I like, like my friends. I love my friends. All right. That's it. It's time for dailies. It's time for the segment of the day where we play games you can only play today. Where I'm opening all the taps now. Boom. We will be, we will be beginning with the wordle. Can we guess a five letter word in six guesses? All right. Let, I'm going to open with satin. We're back. To, we're going back. There's an I and an N. Okay. I'm expecting a double consonant, an I, and then like what? Like, uh? Shint, plint, clint? Okay, okay, okay. Cling, cling. 
So it's uh uh, ing. It's absolutely ing. R kring. Pring, gring, fring, bring, bring. It's not bring. Okay. What else could it end with? I'm looking at the consonants. But in end. Ind, mind, bling? It's not bling. It could end in E, actually. That is true. Like, brine? Let me think of a... Yeah, you know, I jumped a little bit too hard on Clint and bring. We have not tested O. It definitely doesn't end in O. It could end in E. So let's, let's assume it's this, right? Shine. Brine. Ein. The sound at the end is Ein. And it's a double consonant. Like what? There's no L. There's no R. There's no H. Trine. It could. It's not trine. It's H. So it's. Mm. Maybe it's not a double consonant. No. What if? What if it ends in uh, in end? Ind? So what, like... So it's like... Like, consonant... Sorry, vowel, consonant, ind? No. Wine? <gasps> no, it's not wine. That's wine... Is it, is it wine with a D? It's whiny. Oh my god. Boo! <laughs> Boo! Alright. Uh, shout out to Siska for getting me there. Oh, sorry, it's Winnie. It's Winnie? It's not whiny, it's Winnie, isn't it? Freaking hate English. English is dumb. Welcome to Connections! Can we make four groups of four? Super. Can I make you dark mode, please? No? Okay. Super, balloon, stick, swell, domino, jack, neat, uber, hyper, snowball, marble, clean, tidy, ultra, mushroom, trim. Super, hyper, uber, ultra. Uh, things that are good or big or special. Augmented. Uh, domino is a... No, domino. Jack? These are names. Domino, Jack? No. Trim, tidy, clean, neat. Orderly, okay. I do realize, like, neat and and swell. That's a little bit of a trap right there. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, no, no, no. Monterey Jack? No. Domino Mushrooms? Things that have spots? Oh! Maybe? I'm not sure about it, but there's an idea there. There's always a category that's blank word, right? So, like, water balloon... Water Jack, no. Swell, Snowball, Marble, and do this, These are patterns. No. It's not- it, a mar Marble and Domino are patterns. This, these two are connected for sure. Swell, Snowball, Domino, and Balloon. Explain. Domino effect, Swell- Oh- yeah, 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 no, it's because th th when things get out of proportion. One away? It's not domino? Balloon, snowball, swell. Mushroom? Become larger. I hate that. I, I, I absolutely knew what they were doing with mushroom. I hate it. All right, so what's Jack, Marble, Stick, and Domino? Items in classic kids' games. Shut the hell up. Shut the hell up. Oh, my God. Oh, Dale did! Oh, my God, Dale. All right, welcome to Strands. Can we find hidden words? You can say that again. Uh, a motto? Mama. Uh, I need two T's together to make motto. There's a lot of M's, by the way, here. 
Um, uh, more, by the way, can have more. Um, repeat. This should, we need an A for that. Repeat. Oh, I don't think repeat is in there. You can say that again. I see Gertz. My favorite TTRPG, Gertz. Hmm. Man. Uh, moon. I'm just looking for hands at this moment. Sk. Hands and... Tisk? Tisk? Fantastic? No. Mortis? No way. What about Mort? Okay, well, Mort got us there. My favorite show, uh, Rick and Mort. Uh, talk about a show that could definitely use some more Mort. Um, oh, uh, sorry, my son's name is also Mort. There you go, I said it. I said the line. Uh, what about... S sa... <laughs> I want to make a sauce. Shh. No. Sar. My favorite show, Rigor and Mortis. Ah! Damn it, that's that's a good one, Dale. Tempt? No. Tempt. Mm. Tree. Two two. No, it really is. It really is just. Words that are made out of the same syllable twice. Goo goo. It really. Fucking hate this game. This is the worst game. Okay, Coco. Not Coco, huh? Okay. Tin tin. Um. Uh, so, I guess. My mom? Coco nut? Don't no way no way. Nut. Is it is it really coco is it coco nut? It is not coconut. Oh it's ma mama. Just kill the man. Put a sword right through his head. To kiss souls. Now I'm going. Now back to Firelink Shrine. Okay, listen now. Parepa the Rapper? W what are all these letters here? Pom up. Po. Popo? No. Pom pom! It's pom pom! Alright, well, we're, we're working through this. It's Coco for something. It's Coco for sure, but Coco what? Please don't tell me it's this. Thank God. I was scared there was going to be that, that. That. Nana? No. Poco? Dude, like, it's funny because, like, it should be really easy, but this is, like, Nana? Oh, my. No, no, no. Okay, it's Nana. Murmur. Um, I freaking hate this game. I hate this game. Repetition. Repetition. Wow. It's couscous, isn't it? Cous. No. Cous. No. You wrote Nana, not Nana? Oh. Oh. Yeah, that wouldn't work either, because there's the C would get stuck, yeah. It's Couscous. I, I know it's Couscous. Co-co-oos. Co-oos. Co co there you go. It's the can-can. Oh my god. It's the- No. 
This has been the worst one yet, by the way. This is the worst one yet. You used three hints. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And an hour of my life. All right. Welcome to Guess the Game. Can we guess a game from just a screenshot? Be quick on your on your fingertips. Three, two, one. By the way, this is Guess the Game number 699. What is this? Is this... This could be... Is this, um... Two Souls? Sorry, um... Beyond Two Souls? It's not. A new Resi? No, this looks like ass. This could have been from the opening... The opening of, uh... Beyond Two Souls, where you're, like, the spirit. Give me one more. M95 Sniper Rifle, 16 out of 1. This is a shooty shooty bang bang game. It was on the GameCube, the Xbox, the PS2, and PC. Is this first person? With a 58 score on Metacritic. Is it 13? No. Oh, this is gonna be a goddamn, like, Tom Clancy. Action shooter sci-fi. The original COD? No way. With a 58 ra rating? No way. Unless this is, um, is this, uh, the game where you're- Is it Geist? No. 2003. It has a man in it. Is this, is this one of the James Bond games? Is it, is it, oh, it's like a James, is it man, it's not Manhunt, it's like James, it's James Bond. James Bond, everything or nothing, no. Well, I mean, like, guess it. <gasps> oh my god, it's, 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 a, uh, it's, it's Enter the Matrix? Oh my god. I saw the Asian man with the shades, and I'm like, that's him. That's the man from Enter the Matrix. Also, by the way, I'm not going to play it, but, like, I look at this fighting screen. I'm like, this should have the battle theme from, um, from Omicron. <laughs> There you go. All right, Pokedoku time. Can we make a Sudoku with Pokemon, but like in reverse? So, a mega evolved psychic Pokemon, a psychic Pokemon who can learn Shadow Ball, a fighting psychic Pokemon, a fighting Pokemon who can learn Earthquake, a fi flying fighting Pokemon, a flying Pokemon that can learn Shadow Ball, and a mega evolved flying Pokemon. Well, this is Mega Altaria. Oh, Miguel Terry is not flying? Isn't, um, a, a, a Flamigo just fighting flying? Okay, well, that got us there. Uh, a psychic fly, a psychic fighting Pokemon, uh, that is, uh, Meditite. A mega evolved psychic Pokemon, uh, isn't Charizard also flying? Damn it, you're so right, Dale. I'm pissed, I'm pissed. Uh, a, uh, a Mega Evolved Psychic Pokemon. I mean, like, this Altair, there's, um... Oh, Hualucha! You're so right, Chippities. Sorry, I said your whole name. I, ha I said your whole... <laughs> I said, I said, I gave you your whole entire name. Uh, I don't want to just do Gardevoir, but, like... Mega Alaka Sam. Let's just, just Mega Alaka Sam. Whatever. There you go. An, a, an answer is better than no answer. A fighting Pokemon who can learn Earthquake, I am 100% sure that Machamp can learn Earthquake. I knew that. I knew that. Someone who can learn Earthquake and Shadow Ball? Don't talk to me about that. An evolved Pokemon who can learn... Well, what about, what about Mega Machamp? <laughs> What about Mega Machamp? Oh, it's Gigantamax! Okay. 
Hold up, hold up. Tyranitar. All oh, Tyranitar can learn. Thank you, Kitty. I love Tyranitar. He's so spiky. I almost... Could Tyranitar learn Shadow Ball and Earth Earthquake? By the way, Chippy, I was trying to get to your Christian name, but I, I couldn't get there. A Psyche who can... Mew can learn everything. Mew can learn everything. Psychic that can learn Shadow Ball is a bunch, I think. Yeah. Thankfully, Mew got us there. A Mega Evolved Flying. That's just Mega Charizard. Mega Charizard. Ooh. Why? And now we have one final guess. A flying Pokemon that can learn Shadow Ball or a, or a Shadow Ball Pokemon that can learn Earthquake. I probably should have just saved Mew for this guess right here. Now that I think about it. Driftlim? Oh, Driftlim! Good call, Kitty. You saved us. Thank you, my love. Thank you! Alright, so the most common were Medicham, Alakazam, Mega, Go Lurk! Oh, Pidgey of Mega. I'm so silly. The least. Oh, Dot. Dotler. Okay, okay. Uh, Sapdos, Gal Galarian Sapdos is flying fighting? That's funny. Why does this Stantler look shiny? Anyways, well, we'll figure that out. Uh, let's go to game, though. Welcome to the game of guessing games. Can we guess a game by its cover? Uh, this is the ending of Majora's Mask. Uh, this is lovely... This is lovely planet. No. What is this? You know what? Give me one skip. Is it, it the good life? No. Is this the one where you take photos? The one by uh, Swery? Who now we know he's a hack, by the way. This is not like House Flipper. This is a gardening game. This is just a gardening game. Is this House Flipper 2? It's not House Flipper. This is a game about having a garden. A realistic, not anime, not cutesy game about farming. Who are you? What's your name? This is not what remains of Eden Finch, is it? That that corner is scaring me. No, okay, it's Durr. It's Durr. All right, we just have to find the game that ends in Durr. It's not Sundered. Is it Viewfinder? It was via wow, look, it's the game. Boots <laughs> boots with the dur. Now let's try artwork. Can we guess a game looking at the artwork? Uh this is Neo One. This is Neo. This is Neo. I would recognize that katana anywhere. Thank you for coming to this game. <laughs> cool. I would recognize Neo's art style anywhere. Thank you for playing, yes. I saw that katana and I'm like, that is not Sekiro, that is not Ghost of Tsushima. That is Neo and the first one, because the second one had more of a red accent to it and you could make your own character. You could be a hot, sexy demon lady. That is not Geralt of Rivia, excuse, excuse you. Singing, Solitude and Beautiful, excuse me. Singing, Solitude and Beautiful. I mean, it, it, it isn't Geralt, though. It isn't Geralt. His name is, like, John Smith. Gris? Is it Gris? What? <laughs> Good job, Ronnie. Kitty says, I was thinking of, of, of Gris. Were you really? 
All right, uh, you know, let's put Gris in here. So it's a game before 2018. Okay, a game before 2018. Um, let's go with hit me with left left for dead. 2008. Okay, 2008, a first person game. 2008. This is Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare. No. It is not Activision. Mirror's Edge? It could be Mirror's Edge. Not Mirror's Edge. It's not just single player. There weren't any first person MMOs back then. But it's not single players. Hmm. Maybe it has no co op. It's more of a single player multiplayer. It's not Call of Duty. It could be Battlefield. Let's go with Bad Company 2. It is not Electronic Arts. Okay. Ah! Ah! We found it! Okay. So now we know it's a 2008 game. Single player, multiplayer, first person. Give me that clue, please. It is Action, Stealth, Sandbox, and Open World. Sandbox, open world, stealth? First person? Is this the thief? Is this... Thief? It's a shooter adventure game. Single player, multiplayer. The thief remake was later? Okay. 2008? 2008. I'm sorry, what is this icon? Apple II? Oh my god. I thought that was a Stadia icon. Um, or, what was, what was the console? What was the game console that failed before the Stadia? Sort of with a V, I think. The one that was just Android games. He just asks, are there any first-person Metal Gear? Nope. First-person? The, 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 Ouya? The Ouya? Yeah, that's the one I was thinking of. <laughs> ah, single player. We have so many. The Ouya, thank you, love. Thank you. You could see my brain trying to figure out how to spell that. Ooh, yeah. All right, so. Action adventure. Action sandbox open world stealth. It's not Minecraft, right? Is it Minecraft? That was 2011? Wow. Oh, I guess you could play in third person. Stealth is throwing me for sure, yeah. Unless it's... Is there... You, you, you can crouch in Minecraft? Is this Dishonored 1? No. Dude... A stealth game? S op sandbox stealth game. I don't know. I don't know where Max's brain was going with Minecraft, to be honest. I thought Minecraft was older. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Fellas. MGS4? No, no, no. That That is third person, too. I never figure out how to crouch. We'll teach you how. Just hold the control key. I'm reaching into my... I'm reaching back. This may be FNAF. Kendra, shut... Kendra, no. No. No, Kendra, shut up. <laughs> and it's a, it's a game with a multiplayer component. Is The stealth is through... Sandbox first-person action? Saints Row 2, that game had third-person. We also have, like... We have, like, no specifics on, like, what console it even is. It might be Minecraft. We already guessed Minecraft. <laughs> oh, it's not that old. Minecraft is 2011. And it feels like Minecraft has been around since forever, but no. See, Ken Kendra agrees. 
Okay, so... A first-person adventure game with action elements, stealth, and a sandbox and open world. It could be Far Cry. It could be Far Cry 2. It's Far Cry 2, isn't it? It's Far Cry 2. It's Far Cry 2. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> never doubted it. I never doubted it for a single second. That's right, put me in the clip. Put me in the, the goddamn clip. That's right. That's right. There was a crappy multiplayer element to Far Cry 2. I knew it was way too late for it to be Far Cry 1. The, the stealth open world section was getting me, and I'm like, it's Far Cry. It's Far Cry 2. Easy. Now, let's break our brain. I'm going to try this the uh, Cine to Nerdle from today. Let's try it, okay? So there's five movies. Angelina Jolie, Psychiatric Hospital. That's the um, the one where the one with um we're not a writer, yeah, yeah. Angelina Jolie, Psychiatric Hospital. We're not a writer. Uh, that's the one where they're like I forget what the name of it is, but yeah, there's a scene where they go get ice cream. I remember that scene. Nicholas Cage, Sigourney Weaver, clone. Who says he beats? Oh, Angelina Jolie and, and Nicolas Cage wearing the gun in 60 seconds. Good call, good call, good call, good call. Okay, I'm gonna leave this here. I'm gonna leave it like this. Uh, it is uh, gone. So it, it really is it's gone 60. Okay, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. Okay, okay. <laughs> no worries, Siska. Thank you for thank you for joining us today. Have a lovely night. Take care. I love you. Mwah, bye. So long, eh, Bowser. Nicholas Kitch is also an archaeologist. Sigourney Weaver. Gone? 60. Who's I mean, who says he beats? Okay. This has gotten me nowhere. I'm sorry. Archaeologist Nicholas Cage. Dial? And the Dial of Destiny? Wait, is is the Sigourney Weaver one is it what? It's Cabin in the Woods? I don't know. Okay. He's not an archaeologist, though, is he? No, he's not an archaeologist. Dude? Do you just imply Cabin in the Woods was bad? No, I, I implied that you thought Cabin in the Woods was bad. I implied that you thought it was bad. That's why I I have I have my backpack on. We should we should watch. We sh I mean, what was Sassy? Was James Mangold in this movie? Okay, that's done. Okay. Destiny? No. Resurrection. We know a writer goes somewhere else as well. No, Maxi, I have taste. Okay, that's good. Psychiatric Hospital, Archaeologist, Destiny, and Dial. Dude, I'm I'm not gonna I'm not gonna lie to you. I have no idea where I'm going with this. We're not a writer, resurrection, clone, Sigourney Weaver. <laughs> okay. James who's James Mangold? I don't know 
who you are. I don't know who you are. All right, I did it. I did it. I, I did it, by the way. I moved James Mangold over here, and I did it. Please rate it. I will not rate it. It was Joe Care, Indiana Jones, Alien Resurrection, Gone in 60 Seconds, and Girl Interrupted. Okay, that's good. Now, time for the movie to movie. Can we get... <laughs> Can we get from About Time to Dallas Buyers Club? What are these movies? This one is so easy, babe. Excuse me? What are these movies? Eh, ma... Eh, ma... 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 Who are these people? Are this a bunch of British people? Who are you people? There isn't a single SNL, SNL cast member here. Who's Dom Hall Gleason? Is, aren't you the Star Wars guy? You're the Star Wars. Yeah, you're the, you're the freaking, yeah, you're that guy. Matthew McConaughey, okay. Jared Leto? Oh, 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 it really, it really is an easy one, huh? It really, it really is an, it really is an easy one, huh? Wow. Holy crap. <laughs> Bingo. Bingo. Wow, that was easy. Margot Robbie to Suzette Squad to Jared Leto. There's also Tom Hollander to Paparazzi with Matthew McConaughey. All right, let's see about the, the, the ones that we missed. While we were gone. What is this one? Brokeback Mountain? The Neon Demon. This looks recent. Keanu Reeves! Keanu Reeves! Wait, wait, wait. I, I, I actually know how we do I actually know how we do this. Okay, it's Keanu Reeves to an interview with a vampire. No, vampire. Bram Stoker's. Dra it's Dracula. Okay, it's Dracula. It's Dra- We go to Dracula, right? Uh... Who's in there? Gary Oldman. What's Gary Oldman in, by the way? Uh, the Dark Knight. Who's in The Dark Knight? Heath Ledger, who was in Brokeback Mountain. There you go. Mission complete. Easy. Easy. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. That's it, baby. All right, Phyllis. Fellas, yeah, fellas, yeah, has your girlfriend got the butt? Tell her to shake it. All right, so, if no one has a daily game that would like me to play, I'm out of here. I'm, d I I'm, I'm done. I gotta, I have my notes here. I have to literally be out of the house at 2.09 p.m. I am not ready. I gotta do my hair. Go away, stinky. Excuse me? I have one about 80 songs as banned. What why are you banned? Oh, oh. Kendra. <laughs> JP says I play a daily game called Doing the Dishes. Yeah, so do I. I do the dishes every day too. Chippy, do you want me to do your dishes? Is that what you're hinting at, Chippy? Dude, what's your dishes streak? Unfortunately, I always break my dishes streak uh, because I don't do dishes on Fridays. Uh, first solo female artist introduced induced into the Country Music Hall of Fame. Oh, it's already bad. Enthusi enthusiastic energy. No. Don't do that. It's ass today. Oh, no. To show one's feelings. Put on a wall as a poster. Mm-mm. Yeah. Gotta raise you. Double features in movies. Dude, I, what is this? Common Mixer for Ada Cross? Tanqueray or Bombay Sapphire? That's, that's, that's gin. A common mixer for Ada Cross is gin and tonic. Part of a play is an act. Okay, double feature as in movies. 
that will feature in the movies. And it's an ant? Uh, put on a wall? Tape? No. Probably it's not, yeah. Female friend in Spanish is Amiga! It's, a, it's okay, it's Friday, so I will not be getting the big puzzle too much from my small brain. That's fair. To show one's fe feelings. To emote! It might be, yeah. Double feature as in movies? Put on a wall as a poster. Put on a wall as a poster. You tape it, you nail it. You frame it. They got cheeky with this one, did they? Oh my god. Cheap is this. It's to pin it with three ends. There you go. Double feature in the movies. The double feature. The, I mean, this double feature movies. Yeah, but that's a question mark. Which indicates that this is a funny answer. Double feature in the movies. Show one's feelings is to emote, for sure. Punt it on the wall. Wait, is, is it actually, is it pin it? It's not pin it, right? Stint? Stint? No, no way, no way. No way, Ch Chippy's absolutely freaking trying to be a silly, a silly potato. I was goofing. <laughs> Enthusiastic energy. It's Pep! Is it actually Pin It? Okay, then, then what is like, mm-hmm, bet, patob, nope, patab, patib. Okay, can you please check this one for me, please check this square. That is not it, huh? If no one got me, Kendra's got me. Double feature in the movies. What, what double, double. What? Okay, 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 okay. Is it pin up? No way. Shut the fuck up. It's pin up? Oh my god. Yeah, it's yep. Oh my god. Then then what is this? It's Patty. No, but then that makes no sense. To, to, to not, yeah. It's Janet's pinup. A double feature in a, in, a, in a movie theater. Padley. It's Patsy! Oh my god. Alright, we did it. We did it. Alright. Dude, that's gay. <laughs> Stunt? I guess they do. I guess. I guess. Yeah? Dale and I screaming in Midwest. I'm sorry. I'm. So Come on. Do you think I would know who the first solo female artist inducted into the Country Music Hall of Fame would be? Like a buddy double. Shut the fuck up, Kendra. I'm out of here. I'm getting out of here. Ronnie is literally streaming. Ronnie is streaming like in 10 minutes. And Nomia is streaming at 4 p.m. Please check out my friends. Uh, Moon Tomes, and of course as well, uh, Nomia. Please check out my friends. Uh, the secret word of the day is, uh, in the comments of this video, just uh, literally tell me how your day is, okay? And I'll give you a, a, a motivational quote, and that's it. I'm out of here. Thank you for joining me. I'll be back on Monday working on my game, uh, making art, and maybe playing a new game. We'll have to wait and see.
<laughs> See you all tomorrow. Take care, friends. I'm gonna go. Also, I, I mean, I know that you're like Maxi. When do I get to have more Maxi? Uh, I'm playing with Nomia on Sunday on the stream, so you know. If you want more Max, you can have more Max then. But for now, I'm getting out of here. Have a lovely, lovely rest of your day. Take care, friendos. Bye-bye. Beep boop.